welcome welcome to the stream um quickly checking it looks like things are working okay so today i'm going to be playing through crystal creations the new stuff pack oh ah okay and um and I also will be hosting a giveaway thanks to the EA Creator Network for gifting me a code. So uh, let's, I mean, let's get into it. So I started in um, Create a Sim because I figured we should go through the Create a Sim stuff first. And let me turn this on too. Okay, great. Yeah, so we're gonna go through Crystal Creations. We're gonna go through the stuff. Then we're gonna do gameplay. There was a couple questions that I saw on my post that we can get to as well. And then, yeah, give away the pack. Probably more toward the end of the stream to give people a chance to like flow in. But yeah, so, um, oh, and you know what else too? Let me, let me quickly make a little post so that if anybody is interested, they can join. Otherwise, how is everyone doing today? Um, yeah. Okay, honestly, I don't even know if I can be if I can be quick enough with this to get this up. Hello, hello, welcome. Welcome, Moon. How are you doing today? I'm just quickly trying to like <laughs> make a little a little post or something. Um, I meant to do that before I went live, but I was like running a little bit late. But how are you doing, Moon? Okay, I think I'm almost done. I'm so sorry. I also hear my cat. I don't know if she's chewing on something. Cats are cats are so funny with this. Um, Okay. Hi, China. Yes, so this is my sim self. <laughs> um, oh no, it's totally fine. This is my sim self. I just made a post. Lord, okay, so sorry. That was so... <sighs> okay, so yeah, so sorry to recap. We are going to go through the Crystal Creations pack today and we're, that's all we're doing. We're just playing with that. Toward the end of the stream, I'm hoping to give away a code thanks to the EA Creator Network. And we're starting in cast. One, because I didn't I didn't make a save or anything for this. We're just gonna wing it today. But two, because we might as well go through the stuff that comes with the pack, all the cast and everything that comes with the pack. So this is my sim self. This is Mason Road. My name is, in case you don't know, my name is Vanessa Street Mason. Um, and so since my, <laughs> since my name is Street, I, my last name is Street, I made her last name Road, and then her first name is my other last name. I don't know, I just, I thought it was cute. 
So yeah, so this is my little sim self. Um, and I, these are all the outfits and stuff that I gave her, but I don't think we need all these. I'm just, I'm gonna get rid of, uh, all but maybe this one. And then let's go through the stuff. And then I need to make another sim. I guess I don't have to make another sim. We can look at all the masculine and feminine stuff. Uh, okay, so I, and I also, you know what else I didn't do? I didn't disable all the other packs. It is what it is, y'all. I'm doing the best I can. This is the first time I'm really doing this, like just going through everything. So, yeah. Let me just go through, and so I'm just gonna select just Crystal Creations, and let's see. So if you didn't know, I have been playing with the Crystal Creations pack with my Let's Play, the Crystal Magic Let's Play. I actually just filmed episode two of that. It will be going live tomorrow. Like, literally, I finished, um, editing the episode and everything. So that'll be going live tomorrow. So if you wanna see more Crystal Creation stuff, it will be in that video. But in addition to Crystal Creations in that Let's Play, I also play through the Realm of Magic pack because I've never played through that either. Like I have the pack, but I've never played with the Spellcasters. So yeah, so I'm just going through, is there anything that particular came with any of this? I don't think so. I think, oh, and let's, sorry, let's look at the styled looks too. That comes with Crystal Creations. Yeah, yeah. Um, we got new hair. I think we did get new hair. That was something I was missing. Okay, so we'll start here. So it looks like we only got one new, one new um, style. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute in this. You know, having a little sim self is great because it does also give me a chance to be like, you know, what, what would this kind of outfit look like on me? <laughs> You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, so it looks like with this, we've got earrings. Oops. Sorry, with this style look, there's earrings that come with the pack, but then I was also looking and it looks like there's little rings that come with this pack too. How am I gonna see this? Let's go to the nails. Yeah, so we've got a little stacked ring and then we have a little plum bog ring. Now, <laughs> you said you love that outfit. You know, I don't even know if I would actually wear this in real life. The part that I like is the button up with like it buttoned all the way up. I have worn something like that in real life. That's what I was really thinking. Like, oh, that's so cute. The skirt I probably wouldn't wear in real life just because I don't really like skirts. You know, if these were like flowy pants, I would wear those two things together. Um, this plum bob ring though, I don't know if you guys saw, The Sims has like a, a shop now, like an IRL shop and they release jewelry. And I think they're selling this ring. So that's actually really cute that we can also have it in the game. But if we go back to the styled looks, they this came in different colors. So we've got this one, this one. Oh my God, it's so cute. This one. Oh, I like the blue one too. And this, oh my gosh, she's, ah, my little sim self, she's so cute. Uh, okay, and so then what else did we get? So for tops, we only got this top, that's interesting. And these are all the colors that it comes in. Oh, I like the minty one. And yeah, and then for the bottoms, I thought we got more than just the skirt. Oh, we got masculine pants. That's interesting. And these are all the colors this comes in. I don't know how I feel about, I don't know how I feel. Oh, I actually like this, that color, the more army green color. Huh. Okay, do we have more tops that aren't? Oh, we have, this is so weird. Did you see that? How when it was feminine, it was just one top. Yeah. Let me let me see something. Uh, outfit category. No, what is it? Fashion choice. Masculine. So we have four masculine, one with feminine, but then there's six total. But uh, am I? Is it this one? Yeah, this one is not tagged as masculine or feminine. Y'all, I don't I don't know what's going on. Okay, so let's look at this. This sweater, even though it's tagged as masculine to me, is so cute. 
Like, I love this. And I like the colors this comes in. This is amazing. We've got this little sweater too. This looks like something my brother would wear actually. It's kind of funny. Not necessarily with the buttons, but still. So I'm liking how this is looking on her feminine frame and also her larger body. I don't understand this top and why it's not tagged as feminine or masculine. That might be a mistake. I like this little eggplant purple color that it comes in. This is an interesting little thing. I've never worn anything like this, like this little layer with the sweater over it, but the sweater texture to me actually looks really good. This is cute. And then we've got this thing. This is super cute. Just clicking through the colors. Um, yeah. I don't know if you can tell what's happening. I'll change the color and rotate it. And then this we saw because this is what the Sim is wearing in the trailer and the gameplay walkthrough. Oh, I really like the texture on this. This feels like a an actual like cloth kind of texture. You can see the the weave and everything. I like it. You definitely wear the sweater. Which one? I'm sorry, I zoomed past there. Are you talking about the one that's this deep V or this one? What did I call it? The swoop. The swoop sweater. I like the sweater underneath it. I don't know how I feel about the swoop. Although it's cool because it has like a little hood. The little swoop has a little hood and there's like a little knot here. So this is a really cute little sweater. But this one to me, this one's my favorite. I feel like I have worn something like this in real life. Do we have any full body? We do. Should I get rid of the feminine? Oh, hmm. It looks like we only have full body and feminine for these. So we've got this, which is so adorable. Yeah, the deep V cardigan. Yeah. You don't like the swoop one. Yeah, that's fair. Going, sorry, going back to these sweaters. Oh, ma'am, please. Pants, thank you. Yeah, this one to me is a winner. And I don't know why it's just tagged as masculine. I feel like that's a little bit of a miss. Now that I'm looking closer at this though, oh, okay, I thought that when she leans over, it like scrunches up a little bit, but that's just that's just the, the sweater when she moves. Um, going to full body. So we have this sweater dress combo or this turtleneck dress combo. This is adorable. Honestly, oh, I love it in the light blue. This is so cute. Now this little outfit, I think in real life, oh God, would I wear this? It's so, it's like so adorable and so cute. I feel like I'd wanna wear this, but I don't know if I would. Oh, there's even little buttons on the back and the buttons, I think they come out. I don't think it's just flat. And then we've got this little tie and the tie loops actually come off. It looks so cute. This is adorable. And then the little folds. This is adorable. Love this. Uh, this might be my favorite thing. Now this one, I do have one of my Sims wearing this in that other Let's Play I'm talking about. Uh, I think I do, the black version. Oh, I love, I love patterns personally. So I love that this, If you, I don't know if you can tell, this has like stars and like a little sun and like sparkles and stuff. And there's a belt on it that looks like it has like what could be a little crystal gem. Oh. And the pattern version, there's different colors. So for the most part, most of these have patterns, but then you still have the solid option if you'd like. So this one is also super cute to me. I like, and I also like these sort of sleeves in real life. Like I tend to wear things that have more of like a poofy sleeve. So I think I, that this is also one of my favorites. This is cute. This like layered, um, like, I don't know, not a cardigan, what do you call it? Just like the little thing you throw on over like a dress. It kind of looks like there's three layers here. Like there's a dress, a shirt, and then this like little cover up thing. Oh, and then the shirt thing has, it's almost like it's like a glove. I don't know. 
gloved ends. That's interesting. So then we have different colors of this as well. This is actually really cute. I like this. I, I obviously I like this minty color, y'all. I'm so transparent. The monochrome is cute too. So yeah. They said that the theme for like the pack was dark academia. So I don't know if this is necessarily dark academia, but it's a, it's giving me just like a little bit of like romantic y nerd. You know what I mean? This dress with this like over vest thing, super cute. And again, with like the poofy sleeves. You love all the dresses, you think? Yeah. Uh, this is, I love the like little pattern on here too. It's like a floral print. Love this. And you already know. Oh, also if you look to the little chain, I think the chain has some dimension. It's not just flat against the, um, the vest thing. And then there's the belt. Oh, and the chain wraps around the belt in the back. This is super cute. Super cute. Now this little, let me go back to the tops real quick. I wish we had almost like this top. You know, like this as a top. I think that'd be really cute. Well, let me continue going through these colors. So we've got some neutrals. Oh, I don't know why, but I really like this one. Oh, and the gray too. These are super cute. Love this. Love, love, love. Now we saw the pants. Now the only thing is that there is some like socks. So let me see if I can go to a shorter dress. Let's go to this dress. And then we've got these like socks, these thigh highs, adorable, love. Oh, the longer dress reminds you of a fortune teller or something. You're absolutely right. It was kind of reminding me of something too, but I could not place my finger on it. And the little fortune teller thing, is exactly right. Now, these little thigh high socks, these are the colors. These are super cute. Oh my gosh, I actually do love these. Adorable, I wish I had something like this in real life. I don't, see, like I don't really dress like this, you know? This is a very specific oh. aesthetic to me. They did a good job with that. And then for shoes, we have these little booties. Right now, why? If I do the the toes, I can't. You can't even see it. Whatever. Hopefully, you guys can see the shoes. So then we have these different colors. Now it does have crystals on it. It looks like the crystals stay stay the same little blue color. So the booties are cute. I actually like this outfit together. Um, and then obviously we've got the crystal shoes. So these like heels, the, my only critique about these is that the heel seems like unusually narrow or something like, or not long enough. Something about it seems a little off, but it's still very cute. It also looks like something that would be with the, um, realm of magic pack, right? I thought we already had something like this, but apparently we didn't. Oh, I love this color. Ooh, it's like a unicorn. Hello, Moop. Yes, yes. Uh, yes, Cinderella crystal slippers. That is exact. Yes, that is the vibe. So yeah, so that is, I think, all that there is there. Hopefully I'm not missing anything. Shoes, accessories, whatever. Now if we go to, I'm just gonna leave the shoes as is, but I know we got new hair. So let's look at that. Okay, so as far as hair is concerned, we've got this. Swoop de swoop, which I think the Sim in the trailer was wearing this version of it with the color. Okay. This is really cute. So I'm going to click through and just click through the different colors of the hair. 
so you can see I like it I think it's cute you know what's funny I play with a lot of <laughs> I play with a lot of black sims so oh my gosh hello simply welcome welcome um this <laughs> I, I don't tend to like use other hair textures if y'all are picking up what I'm putting down oh my gosh this is cute though uh yeah I like the colored the colored version I think oh my gosh I I usually don't play with the colored hairs either so I don't know what the combos are about to be this is really cute oh I love this too Ooh. oh I like that one okay Oh wait, what's up with this one? Oh, interesting. This one is like white and kind of like gray. This one is much more subtle. That's cute though. All right, let me click, let me keep clicking through. Click, 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 click. Oh, I like this one too. Oh, like a sunset. That one's really cute. Um, okay. Oh, well, I like that one with the, the pink in the front. Oh. I like that color purple too. Ugh. Okay. All right. Well, that was really cute. Adorable. Now this is the hair. It comes with like a crystal bow or something in the back. I don't know. It may not be a crystal. It might just be a barrette. I like this one. I think this one is cute. I do have my sim in this hair in my Let's Play. Um, it's technically tagged as Afro textured, which, you know, is... I, I guess so. Like in these colors, I can see the texture a little bit better. Um, so yeah, oh, I like the green. I don't know why the green was speaking to me just then. That's kind of funny. Uh, and then this hair. This one's really cute. Oh, and it, it, this one definitely has like a little crystal something in the back with the moon. Uh... You can't see the earrings as well in this hair though, but yeah, so I'll just click through so we see. I wonder if this, oh it does. So this little crystal changes color depending on what hair color you have. I, y'all, I wish we could, I wish we could just pick the colors of that. You know what I mean? Anytime there's like accessories and stuff, I'm not even asking for a color wheel. I just wish we could pick the accessories. like. Like, you know, like the, the color of the accessory could be in like the thumbnails down here and then we can change the color of the hair. That's all, that's, that's all I'm asking for. And then this hair, which I think is really cute. I don't know if I've seen anything like this in, in real life per se with like the little rings in it, but I like it. And there's a little braid. I don't know if you can tell there's a braid going up the back. And then yeah, the rings change color based on the hair. Oh, the pink one has different color rings. This one is so cute. Yes, love, love, love. And just clicking through this. So we see, oh, this one has gold and silver in it. Love that. Oh, I love color contrast, y'all. It's my favorite. You can imagine CC creators taking off the clips so we can customize. That's true. That's fair. Oh, <laughs> Moop says, yep, I can do it. I'm a CC creator. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Well, that is the hairs that come with this. Did we get any like accessories or anything? Um, I don't think so. What about here? So we obviously got jewelry that's in Create a Sim. So can you see the necklace in this? Yes, you can. Okay, so the earrings and necklace combo. Let me change the color of the dress so that we can better see this. Okay, earrings. I'm gonna just angle her a little bit Actually, no, I'll keep her straight on. Um, 
is the gallery still down? I don't think so. I was able to take some stuff. I was able to get my sim cell from the gallery. When was the gallery down when you were playing? Um, okay, so this is black. Black and gold, black and silver. This is like gold with purple and blue. I can't even speak. Silver and blue, green and gold. Oh, th this is very delicate. I do like this. And it feels very contemporary. You know, like having multiple piercings and they're kind of stacked like that. I like that. And then it looks like we have matching necklaces stacked. So we've got this, it looks like the same colors. Oh, and then it's little beads, like little beading. So that's fun. And I think, yeah, like this is the matching little set. So that's super cute. And then I know, hmm. Uh -huh. Let me just look at the rings because we looked at the socks earlier. Now, if I go to the rings, it's just, why can't we see the ring? Oh my gosh. That's, that's uh -huh. the one thing. Can I zoom in? No, of course not. Of course not. Why, why would I be able to zoom in? All right, well, we've got it in gold. We've got it in silver. I'll just go back and forth. Rose gold. Okay. Rose gold. And black. Mm, go back here. So that's a little plum bob ring and you can you I think you can make the purchase in real life if you want to match your sim. And then the other accessory is the ring on the other side. So this little stacked ring. So there's a lot of colors of this. This is the matching color set to the earrings and necklace that we just looked at. It looks like. Yes, there is a lot of jewelry in gameplay for sure. So this is the little stacked ring in black very delicate very cute and how how quickly can i go through this is this going to be a mess silver i just need to be able to go back and forth easily the blue and the purple stack blue Um, I, I don't know if I'll go through all of them. You, you, you get the gist. It's the same, it's the matching situation to the earrings and the necklace. I want to be able to go through all of them. It's just, they make it so frustrating. I don't have the mod installed where it just like zooms in when you're wearing the accessories, but I feel like that should be my next mod download because this is, <laughs> this is absurd. Oh, I like the pink and green. That's so cute. Um, I also, you know what's funny? I don't wear jewelry like this, like the dainty jewelry. Oh, the pink and purple, I like that one too. I like wearing chunky, like chunkier, um, I can't speak, chunkier rings and stuff. You actually look, I like the plum bob ring too. Um, you said Aretha B makes good CC. I gotta check that out. Um, I like the plum bob ring as well though. What, did I just look at that one? Yeah, I did. This one's red and gold. There's only a few left. Let's see here. This is the black and the red with silver. I think these additions though are good. Like these were needed. I think this, the cast alone I think is really cute. You know what I mean? It's not like super, super extensive, but we got something in most of the categories. I think the only thing that we're missing is we didn't get any makeup, right? And then this one, this one's cute. Now what, what color am I wearing? I think I'm wearing this one on her little outfit. Like all of these matching. So yeah, so the only thing we did not get, I think is makeup, let me see. Or did I just not see it? Yeah, we didn't get anything here. So that's okay. I guess we don't need something in everything. Do I use mods or CC? So yes. 
in general, I try not to play with a lot of mods in CC. That's my general rule. I used to play with none. And then I started using better build by, and I was like, <laughs> of course I'm gonna play with better build by. So now I pay, play with that for the most part. And then I'll download CC for a special occasion. So I downloaded some wedding dresses for a wedding that I did on stream. And I'm not opposed to it, but I'm trying to play with like more limited just because like keeping my gameplay and everything accessible. Um, yeah, these are, I, I love these. So let's, let, let, let's actually dress her up real quick for this today. She's definitely gonna wear this little dress cause I just find this so cute. And also, no hate to the new hair or anything. Uh, well, let's see. I don't. I don't think I want her to wear this. She's either gonna. She's uh, her hair's either gonna be this or it's gonna, it's gonna be an afro. <laughs> I'm only laughing because like, again, hair texture wise, this this reminds me of you know when you like get a perm, <laughs> you get a perm and then you like cut it all off. Like this is a style. You know what I'm talking about? Like the aunties that have this hair. <laughs> Um, but let me, let me exit all this. Where, where, where's the little fro where she, that she had before? <laughs> oh, okay. That's not the one she was wearing. It's this one, I think. Was this one that she was wearing? I think so. She was, her, I, so I usually select this one but I feel like this one is more realistic to how my hair actually looks in real life. Look how cute she looks! She's so adorable! Okay. The aunt, you know, China, you know what I'm talking about. You know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. If I, maybe this one. Where, wait, which one did I select already? I selected this one. So we have this, so this is fine. I'll even leave the boots. Well, maybe I should. She should wear black boots. I don't. I, I don't think so. I guys. I have mixed feelings about these boots. Mixed, mixed feelings. I like them in blue though. Or maybe I like them in this kind of like gray color. I like the fact that you need to work in the game to get all the jewelry. It makes the game more challenging. Yes, I agree. And also, when I was going through debug, you when you go through debug, the the jewelry isn't complete. Like it's almost like the shell of the jewelry when you pull it down. We'll look at it. We'll look at it. Um, but it doesn't have all the different gems and metals and stuff, which is interesting as well. Uh, okay, so uh -huh. this is outfit one. Oh, without, I'm missing the necklace. That's the only thing that she's missing. So let's wear the necklace and I want to use, yeah, this color. And the matching, I love how there's a whole matching little set. It's so cute. And then for her second little outfit, Where's that sweater? <laughs> we'll wear this. Ma'am, put on some clothes. Okay, she's not gonna wear the skirt. I just needed to put, <laughs> put some pants on her. Uh, take that off. But I like the I like the grandpa sweater, so cute. And then what, would she just wear some jeans or something? Are these tagged, these are tagged as jeans? That's interesting. <laughs> You said try the long curly hair, she'll look good. I did, I did try the long curly hair. I wasn't feeling it. Look, I'll show you. I'll show you, I'm gonna humor you. But just to be clear. It's cute. That's not, that's not what's, what the question is here. It's cute. But Mason? Me, my my stem self, we gonna keep we're gonna keep the fro. You know what I'm saying? Um. Okay, let me get let me get rid of this crystal creations thing, and let me just find some jeans. Maybe we can just find some base game. Oh, these are cute. No, not not with this. <laughs> these are university pants. This is kind of cute. 
I don't even hate the shoes with this. Although it doesn't make, I know it doesn't make sense, y'all. I know it doesn't make sense. But I don't hate it. Let me go to just look at base game. What do we have in base game? Um, Nothing. Oh, wait, let me look at jeans. That's what I want. Okay, so we've got these. Huh. These are like super skinny jeans. I feel like I can't even walk. Uh, yeah. Do I want to wear the sweater in black? Is that is she wearing black? Yeah, she's wearing black here. We don't have to have it in black. Oh my gosh. So this this sweater, this sweater is everything. Let's do green. She'll have a green and black thing happening. And then <laughs> with the crystal heels that don't make sense. Uh, no, not shorts. Did you guys know that we had a sequin skirt in the base game? Because I did not know that. I feel like I missed the memo somewhere. Okay, this... First of all, this is hilarious as an outfit. I... <laughs> love it conceptually. Not gonna do that. The crystal heels are an absurd concept. They are. They are an absurd concept. We're gonna roll with it though because it. We might as well. It's Sims. You know what I'm saying? It's just about. Oh, these aren't. These are not. These are like jeggings. Okay. Uh, I like these too. I like this in a pattern. Oh my gosh, it's just making me uncomfortable. They're so tight, it makes me uncomfortable. If Malcolm was her landlord. <laughs> Let's move into Malcolm's. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, do I have to look at the rest of this? Uh, we're, we're probably not going to do anything else. I mean, she's pretty much... What do, what do I have here? Everything else is pretty much fine. I don't think we have to do anything there we didn't have any hold on wait let me just let me just double check something okay no yeah i think we're good we'll we'll change our formal wear i guess i i doubt we'll ever see any of this stuff but you never know uh let's i'm gonna leave it we're we're playing through like nothing much today um okay so we've got over here we have a new aspiration creativity do, do we have a new we, yeah right i'm playing i'm literally playing through it uh is it under knowledge am i am i being foolish right now where oh okay no, is it the cute? What? What am I? I know this one. Jeez, y'all. Oh my gosh. Okay, yes, we have a new aspiration. It's the Crystal Crafter. This sim wants to cut. Can you read this? Okay, cool. This sim wants to cut gemstones, craft jewelry, and harness the power of crystals. It's under the nature section. And the bonus trait that we're gonna get is collectors. Collectors can find rare collectibles more often. And then we're also going to say that Mason likes gemology, which is a new like that comes with the pack. Hmm. And I could I, I, I couldn't tell you, is it alphabetical? Did I go past it? I did. So we're going to say likes gemology. Look at her. Okay. All right. Relax, relax. Okay. So she's, uh, okay. <laughs> she's clumsy, creative, and self-assured. I don't think we didn't get any new traits with this pack. Just the new like and um, or the new likes, dislike and the aspiration. Um, and then we've got Regine here. Regine. <laughs> yeah, I think I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, and that's it, right? 
<laughs> yeah, we don't we don't need to worry about anything else. So we're gonna hit play. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> is in the nature section though? Is that your IRL cat? Yes, my real life cat. Her name is uh, Maxine, <laughs> and she's a great tabby. Where is she? Is she in around? She's probably believe she's probably in the bedroom. I, I don't know. Um, okay, so where are we gonna live? I don't. I so I don't want to live in Glimmerbook because I live in Glimmerbook in the Let's Play. So we can live. Maybe we should just live in like a base game world. Um, should we live in Oasis Springs? Because that's where I've been doing a lot of looking for stuff. And then we can just move to like a base game house. Nookstone. Uh, Agave Abode. I haven't looked at any of these before. I'm just gonna move in here. So I want to, so here, here's a couple things. I wanna be able to uh, look around to figure out where are good places to try to like collect stuff. And then, um, what was, somebody asked some questions. Hold on, let me look. What questions am I supposed to be figuring out here? Do the crystals have interactions and which is my favorite jewelry? So this will be interesting. So let's go, now that we've gone through cast, let's go through build buy. Ooh, also I've never seen this house. Let me, look, look. It's, it's fine. It's just, I've quite literally never looked at this before. Huh. Okay. Um, this isn't very big to like look at everything. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to save this. We're just gonna save this to my library, Agave Abode. It's hideous. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And we're gonna bulldoze everything. Not because I, not even because I think it's hideous, just because I wanna look at um, the stuff. Did that not work? So we're gonna give ourselves some money. Is that? Okay, cool. Yeah, I just don't wanna um, have to figure that out. So let's look at Crystal Creations, the room that comes with this. Okay, so this is the room that we have with Crystal Creations. So they made a little, what is it, what do they call it? They called it the Crystal Clear Workshop. Uh, oh, I thought there's no like descriptions that come with this. Okay. And then we can go and we can look at all of the stuff. Show all. And yeah, we'll have Crystal Creations. Okay, cool. Also, have you guys gotten the pack? Have you gotten the pack? Are you planning on getting the pack? Like, what are your th what are your thoughts? Are you hoping to win a copy of the pack today? Thanks to the A Creator Network. Got to make sure that I shout that out because, uh, yeah, that's the reason I'm able to give away a pack today. I'm gonna put this up. We're just gonna we're just gonna look at everything really quickly. I don't know if you guys watched the gameplay walkthrough walkthrough as well. I'm gonna put this. This stuff in here to me is super, super cute. I'll have that hanging off. Uh, the rug, this little thing, this thing. We can also talk about the best items in our, in our opinion, what we think the best items are. Oh, what? Burning Midnight Oil Lamp? That's cute. I didn't even know that was in here. This is why we're doing this today. Because I did make a build <laughs> with this stuff, <laughs> but I clearly didn't even use everything. Okay. You want, <laughs> simply you're like, yeah, yeah, I want to win. <laughs> 
you're thinking about it for the bookshelves. What is up with, what is up with that when it comes to Sims packs? I find that I will buy a whole pack just for one or two things. And I will say that before, so for, first of all, my little, my Sims YouTube anniversary is in a couple of days. Like I, I made my YouTube channel a Sims YouTube channel March last year. So it's been one year, but before I even had a Sims YouTube channel, I had like, I had 80% of the packs because a few years ago, I was going through a rough breakup and the packs were on sale. And I was like, I deserve this. <laughs> So I bought all the packs. I bought most of the packs, but most of it I just bought for maybe like one or two things and just because I wanted everything. Um, so I don't know. I, <laughs> uh, so yeah, now I feel like there's one or two things across all the packs that kind of make the pack worth it. But it also kind of feels like, why is all of the different stuff in so many different packs? You know what I mean? Anyway, so this is the bookshelf. The bookshelf combo, they did one with and without a ladder. The ladder obviously is for aesthetics. There is no function to the ladder, but it is super cute um, either way. And I like the different colors. I also like that we have purple bookshelves. That is super cute. I'm gonna change it to purple. So the bookshelves, yes, that's, that's a win already. This is the star of the pack, the actual table that you can do gemology on, if I'm not mistaken. What is this called? It's called the all-in-one gemology table by Humphrey Incorporated. Now, I don't know if you saw the lore behind this, but apparently this table is named after one of the characters in Lil Simsy's Let's Play. And I find that so, so cute. Uh, you get FOMO for watching people who have everything, so I buy them all too, yeah. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so this is the little table. It's super cute in action. Love the colors. Love that it has, I don't know which is the best watch to look at. Love that it has like a little moon on it and all of the different things. You know what, I el you know what else? I love that we got this new skill activity. Oh, you see the, like the little drawings of the ring, little sketches, so cute. But I like that we have this little activity because jewelry making in real life, did you guys ever go through a jewelry making phase? I used to make jewelry like with beads, like beaded jewelry, but I always wanted to take a class to like, I don't know, do casting and stuff with real metal. White bookshelves. I can take, I can make them white. These are super, I think they're super cute. This would be such a cute, like modern aesthetic room, you know? Um, yeah, so I, I don't know, I love this. I love that it has little sketches. I love that it has little tools and little pieces on it. It's adorable. And then we've got this little case, which I really like this case. This is the kind of thing I wish I had in real life to display stuff. It has a little crystal knob. I don't know if you can tell, like a little crystal knob here at the bottom and glass panes. This is a nice object. And these are the different colors, obviously matching. Everything in this set, all the stuff matches together. And let's keep looking at the furniture. So this is just a regular desk. I put this thing on top just because I needed to put it somewhere. But again, same colors. And oh, I like this with the, um, the turquoise and the gold. That's really nice together. And so I'm just gonna make everything purple and white today. Uh, and how many slots does this have? So if we got a computer, let me just turn this off. Okay, so I'm gonna use this old computer, right? And then how many of these can we put on here? We can put this here, here. Oh wow, you see how many slots this has? Okay, 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 here's the problem, here's the problem. I've got move objects on. So let, let me turn off move objects. Hold on a second. Let's try this again without move objects. Okay, so we can put this here, here, and then look at this. Look at all the slots that this desk has. I don't know how many slots desk normally have, but this feels like a lot. Yeah, that's really cool. So you could have this covered in like crystals, collectibles, all kinds of little stuff. 
And then since this is here, we might as well look at the colors of this little thing. So there's like a little gray base. The base colors change. Oh, and then there's an all black. Now, this is just decor, I'm pretty sure. Because I, I put this out thinking that we could put like um, jewelry on it, but I don't think you can. This is called Cordelia's Bust. Let your crafted necklaces dazzle against this linen bust modeled after Princess Cordelia herself. Okay, I guess I'm a liar. I, I, it says let your crafted jewelry, so we're gonna have to figure that out when we are playing. The craftsmanship of this stand is of the highest quality and there is no better way to showcase your masterpieces. Y'all, I am a liar. I did not know you couldn't put your stuff on here. We're gonna have to test that out because I literally, in my other Let's Play, I tried to put some of these out, but they, it didn't work. At least I thought it didn't work. Um, okay, really quickly, this little thing, is this a lamp? Oh, it is. Oh my gosh, look, this, this little lamp works at night. I didn't even realize that. That's so cute. Okay, yeah, we've got this little midnight oil lamp is what it's called. Burning the midnight oil lamp. While it may not provide the best light for late night gem cutting sessions, this elegant piece certainly sets the ambiance. Oh, and there's just like the tiniest little flame. Can you see that? It's like barely there. Love that. Love that for us. Uh, so let me, let's go back to daylight. <laughs> thank goodness, thank goodness it matches. Yeah, they did, listen. One thing Sims at least is gonna try to do is at least give us the coordinating stuff in the same pack. At least lately. Now whether or not it matches to anything else in the game, TBD. Uh, okay, so this little midnight oil, oil thing, let me make this white so it's not so distracting. So we got it in white and then these other colors. Oh, I like it with the little stripes on it. The little gold, that's super cute. I don't think I use this in any of my builds, so that's cute. Um, and I know I said I was gonna go through the furniture, but we might as well look at this lamp. So we've got this kind of, it kind of looks like a spotlight situation. Um, shine so bright spotlight. Okay, yes. What better way to enjoy your crystal creations than in the perfect light? interesting and then yeah coordinating colors for the most part this one doesn't come in purple so that is unfortunate they did make a teal version of this same as this hmm they have a teal bias the sims team a teal green bias i don't know how i feel about that does this also come mm -hmm. yeah obviously they would because it's sims but I would have also liked this in purple. I don't see why we didn't get this in all the colors, but that's okay. Something about that lamp, lamp makes me think it's gonna cause a fire. You mean this midnight oil one? Yeah, it's a little, and like I said, you see the little flame. It's a little, mm, mm. Okay, so we also have a coffee table. Comes in all of the same coordinating colors, so that's good. Uh, I like the detail. Oh, I like the carved wood idea. I like this furniture a lot. I will say that. I do think that this furniture can be used in different like styles and aesthetics of house. So there's that. And I still have move objects off. So let's check to see how many slots we've got. Oh, this is, there's a lot of slots on here as well. So that's really good. You can really style things the way you want. Hold on, can we find some magazines? gosh that's the other thing they need to fix their search because I don't know the exact name of anything you know what I mean because this isn't even what I'm looking for y'all know what I'm talking about the little stack of like books or whatever it's it's just it's it's exhausting for me I don't know what anything's called look we got some fake mail letters by the pile we can put on the coffee table. I'm just looking for things that would that might go on a coffee table. See how many slots we have. Pop up story time. No. Oh, this. What is this called? Sensational, sensational style stack. Like what? If I search magazine, this should come up. That's all I'm saying. This. This should come up. 
but okay yeah we've got we've got a coffee table that has the different slots on it can you put shoes on here i don't know why you would want to but you can okay i like this i like that it's glass too that's really cute okay so then we have this nightstand what is it called workshop perk stop <laughs> that's cute workshop perk stop table same colors matching set just because I'm just just to prove that everything like matches I'm just gonna make everything match right now not saying that this is the color of anything that we want but still love it so same colors what is the description for this so it's found in the accent tables okay it says when working diligently in the workshop yearning for a break to drink some soda pop the kitchen seems more than a skip jump in a hop so soon the idea is when you drop they have way too much they have too much fun with this <laughs> ah, the machino stack of magazines that's that's what i was looking for earlier just for the record but it was called something the style stack or something like that now I know just to search stack because that's really what I need. Now why can't this go up here with this little... <sighs> that was obnoxious. Anyway, this is cute. It has little cast... It's on like caster wheels. There is this little um, open space in here. Can I put anything on here? I don't think so. I think it's just there to be you know for style purposes but it would be good if we could put something on there i'm trying to put something little in that area it doesn't look like we can even this no yeah okay well it's open it doesn't look like anything can actually go in here but it's still cute aesthetic wise let's get rid of all this um, okay, so I'm gonna move this out of the way really quick. Well, yeah, let's look at these first. So these are little clutter items. Gemologist field kit is what this one is. Found under miscellaneous, I guess. And then these are the different colors. Let's see. It's hard to tell, but the mat changes color and some of the items on the mat change color a little bit. So it looks like we've got like a necklace, a little hammer, the little tweezers, some wire, and I'm assuming some more sketches on this little, probably like a little leather mat or something, a little felt mat. Oh, China, I also see that you said you work in fine jewelry. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. Um. Then we have this, which looks like a little jewelry case. It says it's the Pretty Pieces display box. And it has an environment score. Oh, does this one have an environment score? Environment one. So when you put these out, it'll also contribute to the sim thinking that it's nicely decorated. Okay, so I can't get any closer. Wait, can we get any closer? Let me get rid of this. This is the closest we can get. All right. Um, so it looks like in the pretty pieces display box. Oh, the jewelry even changes. That's interesting. I don't know if you can tell. Some of it is like all white. And then some of it is the different colors. And then the box changes in each option. So we've got a brown box cream box, gray box, teal box, because you know they like their Sims green, a white box and a black box. And then you either have colored jewelry or not colored jewelry. So you can see here. Oh wait, I was like, can we get closer? No. So yeah, so these are the little jewelry items. You know, they're a little, they're a little pixelated, but you're not even gonna be that close, you know? And then, 
the colored options. So like earrings and the necklace and stuff. Hi Nick, hi. How are you doing? Um, I saw that you commented on my old, my old video <laughs> of going to the Brooklyn Museum. That's back when I thought I was gonna have a fashion channel, y'all. <laughs> a fashion and crafting DIY channel. Um, okay, so now we're moving on to this accent table. I love this item. I think that, first of all, how do I get, uh, I'm forgetting my shortcuts here. Uh, I love that it has like the little crystal knobs. Okay. And yeah, they actually like stick out and they're multi like faceted, like little crystals. I love this little item. And it comes in all the same colors of everything else. So that's good. And it also looks like the knob is either like iridescent colored or white. So I'll show you what I'm talking about. So it looks like, so be, like between these two, this one, you see how the crystal is just more like a white crystal, okay? And then in this one, the crystal knob is more like iridescent. Or is that not what, what's happening? Is it just depending on whether or not the plate is black or gold? Maybe that's what's going on. And I just think it's iridescent and it's just reflecting. Okay, well it's a plain crystal knob, but it's cute. I like it. This table's dope. Now let's see what we can put on it. As far as clutter items, uh, hmm. If I take this, so these are the different spots we have. And then we also can put it, let me see. There's stuff can go down here. I know that for a fact. Yeah, this table, love this. Uh, let's see, can we put some down here? Yeah, 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 yeah. So look at all this stuff. You can put all this stuff down here. I'm just, I'm just trying to grab something. Look at all these slots of different things. So this isn't the best display of what can go down here, right? Like, again, I'm putting books and stuff. Magazines. Oh, maybe not these. Uh, does this go down here? Yeah, yeah, what's this? books and baskets huh it is interesting right now to see like what works and what doesn't on here because i found a lot of things that i was able to put down here at least i thought i did let's get rid of this let's go back to the clutter yeah you can put little cups this this table great love it fave um, now this little seat thing, do we have anything else? Yeah, we've got a couple more things. Okay, cool. This seat thing, I can't, y'all, it's a love seat. What am I talking about? <laughs> Tufted love seat, comfort six. It has a little bit of like a, I don't know if that's a floral pattern or a little heart pattern or what on this swatch, but like, yeah, these are the different colors that it comes in. Very cute. And it's also very comfy. And then this is like a little desk chair. Oh, the, the little seat here looks a little worn. I like that. Like it's just a little bit older, but you can see the edge here, like where someone would sit down. That's pretty realistic in my opinion. Okay, so we've got some more clutter items as well. So let's take a look at these. Uh, this is called the Jewelry Box Jamtacular. Jamtacular, Jewelry Box Jamtacular. Also has an environment score, so people will think it's well decorated if you have this placed. And these are the different colors that it comes in. So let's take a look at this one. I love all the little pieces on this. I love the little necklace, the earrings. This is a nice little uh, little object. It'd be cute if it was like, I don't know, functional. Like we could click on it and like store things, you know? Um, And then we've got this little piece, a jeweler's tray. 
Okay, another decorative object. So these are the different colors, same colors that it comes in. The different boxes change color depending on which swatch you have. So for instance, this little teal swatch, and it looks like there is some, just some tools and some like in progress jewelry here. And then this is the gemologist field box as opposed to, what was this called? The gemologist field kit. So this is also one that comes in all the different swatches. And this has a little notebook in it. I think so you can have take your little notes and have little sketches. Uh, there's like a little rolled up mat and stuff. This is really cute, I love this. Now this, y'all. This is the table, the inventory table that you can sell uh, jewelry on, okay? I'm just, let me move this stuff out of the way. Now, I, first of all, this as a, one of the seller tables, very cute. Uh, you can see that it has stuff underneath, you know, like little boxes and storage underneath it. But if you, if you saw part one of my, my new Let's Play, you know that this thing doesn't work inside and it's devastating for me. Oh, and it also doesn't come in as many colors. Okay, that's your choice. Mostly like neutral wood colors. Um, but this doesn't work inside and that's unfortunate because I have a little shop that I set up that should, I wanted it to work inside. Now I did see a comment just now that you said that a lot of these little clutter items would look so good in a walk-in closet. And you are so right. I didn't even think about that. Like this would be so cute in a closet. Like ha look at this, these together too, multiple of these you could have like the one with the color jewelry and one with the white jewelry. And so all three of these like totally decked out. And that's just that stuff. You could also include this if you wanted to, but this in the walk-in closet would be great. Um, okay. This is the crystal charging mat. Moon, yeah, the, oh my God. Mystical moonlight crystal charging grid. You can place up to seven gemstones or jewelry pieces. And it comes in all the different colors, which we are familiar with. This thing is super cute, super cool. You can have as many on your lot as you want. Uh, this is, I love this plant. I like the, um, the vase thing for the plant, the stand, the plant stand. And I like the plant itself. Also more so in the neutral colors, but I think this, this mesh is, it looks really good. And now look at this, love this, this little terra terranium type thing, crystalline vivarium. While the scientists at Future Sim Labs have no idea how it works, there's no denying plants grow faster in the vicinity of charged crystals. Super cute, look at this, love this. And then it comes in these different like container color things. The crystals, there's a couple of different crystal variations, but in general, this little thing is, I love this. You said there's only one plant, unfortunately. Yeah. But I think, I think of the one plant to get, this is a good one. This is a good one plant to have. Now this rug, there's a few different swatches. Oh my gosh, I wish you could move this little pop-up um, because it's hard to see, but there's like a sun and a moon version of the swatch, so that's cool. Love this, and is this, is that, hold on. I know I took out everything, so I know this is technically it. I just got confused by something. Okay. Okay, well this rug, I thought that this thing, there was like a matching thing, but maybe not. These to me kind of coordinate. Let me move this closer. I've just got all this stuff out, it's kind of funny. Gives you the vibes of Realm of Magic. Yeah, well, let, let's double check that actually. 
Well, let's double check that together because that's something too that like, I'm wondering how close the stuff is. So this is the wall art. So this is the first swatch and then we have like a moon swatch and then the moon phases. I love this little art piece. To me, the, all the moon things remind me of the werewolves pack. Like the werewolves pack to me, if it wasn't so just like dingy, would be perfect with this stuff. And I don't mean that like the werewolves pack is dingy, but you know, all of the stuff that comes with that pack is like kind of like worn down and just like haphazard. It was a style choice. Then we have this like, what is this called? Crystal Chronicle poster. So there's some variations here, like looking at the different crystals. Love this art piece, especially this one, because it has like the cropped in. So I like that. Um, and then we have another like display case. Dignified display shelf. Comes in all of the matching colors that we've already seen today. Okay. We've got another display shelf, undignified display shelf comes in all of the colors that come with this pack. And then quickly, let's just grab another one of these, the busts. So you can put, you can put, um, oh my gosh, I'm not holding down shift. I don't have move objects on, right? Yeah, move objects isn't on. So this is how many little things you can slot into this shelf. So if it has a smaller footprint, you can see that there. Uh, this little shelf here, the final finial, same thing, all of the same colors. We've got another display shelf. And these, these are the ones that lock up together also. So like if I grab this, this is like, you know how Dream Home Decorator, they introduced the stacking um, shelves. So in theory, you can grab this as a unit and like move it around together. But these are a little buggy. Do you guys experience that? Like sometimes I'll leave, like I'll put a bunch of stuff in here, you know what I mean? And then I will uh, leave the lot and come back and then some of the stuff will end up in my inventory. So that's the only thing about, the, the, about these like, um, I don't know, lockable little shelves or whatever, that they, they can be a little weird. I still like them though, I do. And then we have this mirror with like a crystal on it. The artisan's glass. It says crafted from the glass, forged by the breath of dragons and framed by gold dug, excuse me, framed by gold dug from the deepest caves. This mirror will reflect the shine that not only comes from your physical beauty, but your inner gut health. Okay. Again, they, they have a lot of fun with these descriptions. And then these are the colors it comes in. I like the pink one, the rose gold. Um, yeah, and then we have this, which is just like, it says the all-star tool rack. And then it comes in these colors as well. So I know I took a lot of time looking at all of these things, but hopefully you guys get like a good idea of like what everything looks like and the colors of everything. So then this is the, um, the room that they made. So one thing I didn't do when we were out there is put stuff on the bookshelf. So you can see that they put some things on the bookshelf. They have the jewelry display case at the bottom here. They have the little vivarium thing. And then they have some other like base game decorations on the other shelves. So there's a lot of like, whoever said that there's a lot of potential with the bookcases, there definitely is. And then when we're looking in the room, what did they put inside the display case? Oh, they put more jewelry stuff inside the display case here. Uh, they also have this curtain with that chair in front of the window here. Yeah. Everything in here is super, super cute. Now, the one thing we didn't look at is the wallpaper. So let's see what we have. I don't think I missed anything else. We've got wallpaper. Do we have any build mode related things? I don't think so. 
just checking it looks like it's just the wallpaper no floor okay I do like the wallpaper that comes with this though so just looking at the different colors We'll rotate this. There you go. I'm just gonna take all this out so we can see all the swatches at once. They have a lot of colors of this. And we just need one more. So they gave us one wallpaper, but these are all of the swatches that it comes in. So we've got the blue, the white, the orange, purple. What is that? Like a, a grayish blue? White, black, like a teal color that kind of goes with this. Uh, green, red, gray, gray blue, brown and actual gray. Yeah. So that's everything. That's all the stuff that comes with the pack that's in um, that's in the regular catalog. Now, if we let me just let's just look really quick. Just 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 quickly. If I put on Crystal Creations and then I go to uh, Debug and Live Edits, maybe and show all. Anything of any particular merit? So we've got, these are the new crystals that we can discover. Jade, M Moonstone, and Amber. They also, it looks like we've got new metals. Gold, uh, we didn't have gold? That's crazy. Rose gold. Anything else? Uh, I guess nothing else. And then this is what I was saying about the um, crafted jewelry from Debug. So you can get all of the different things from Debug. The only thing is there's really nothing in it. Like it's just kind of like in its default state. <laughs> Gone are the days where we only had three wall swatches. Yes, yes. Remember when they gave us like all those swatch updates? <laughs> Just free swatch updates. Um, so yeah, what is this? Oh, gemology book display. Okay. Oh, so we, ha we have a new gemology skill book. And I think that's the gist. What is this? Bling ring. Oh, that's something that we can make. Okay, cool. So I, this, is, this has been lovely lovely looking at everything but let's bring back our ugly house and let's let's start playing i'm gonna put the bare minimum of stuff in here Ooh, first of all it is it is very dark in here so let's at least do that the potential of this pack is the gameplay for sure yes you are absolutely correct uh, also, you know what we can do? Let's use that room. Does that fit here? Oh my gosh, it like fits here perfectly. Um, yeah, that fit, that fit perfectly there. The only problem is it got rid of, it got rid of some stuff. So we'll put that here. 
Can I put a, a window there? I can. Now I am curious, can I go back? How far back can I go? No, I can't. Cause I, I realized that I forgot to look at the, um, this stuff with Realm of Magic. But just remind me at the end and we can do that. Uh, okay. I put a window where it doesn't make sense. So let me just move this over and we'll use the mirror in the bathroom. Gosh, it's so dark in here. Oh, you know what? I got rid of all the lights. Like, what am I talking about? Uh, lighting, and I just want to use the little saucers. Uh, I'm gonna have to turn off debug. I don't want that on. I think all in all, just in general, between cast and build by, I like it. I like the pack. I think that even if I wasn't in the EA Creator Network, I would get this pack. Now, I didn't realize that this is a pack that I would have wanted. So I don't know about y'all, but when it was first announced, you know how people can be a little grumpy. They were like, who asked for this? And at first I was like, yeah, I guess. But then when I really thought about it, I like crystals in real life. Um, and so, and, and then once you see all the effects that the different crystals have, it's just like, who wouldn't want this? This is so much fun. Like more things to do in The Sims. You know what I mean? Uh, anything else that she needs? Oh my God, this place is, this place is really, really sad. I, I guess she doesn't need a TV or anything. Not decorations. What am I trying to do? Electronics, TV. Let's get a frame TV in here. Also, is it too much to make the whole house like use use this i think it is you asked for this <laughs> yeah i don't know i just think people you know people are just i think people are really what's the word i'm looking for the sims is in a weird state right now because there's just a lot of bugs so i think people are just aggravated which is understandable but it's it's also like let us get cool stuff <laughs> you know you wanted more hobbies and things to do so i like it yeah me too that's that's where i'm at i'm like i don't know this is this is really cute i like this stone better from from jungle adventure uh okay i mean we don't this doesn't need to be amazing we i put the room here so that's good oh you know what else too actually do they have a different color for the room Cause that's another thing with the styled rooms. They should come in different colors, like how the styled looks come. Okay, yeah, there, there's the white one. Whoever said that they liked the white bookcases, there's a whole white room here too. And then there's red. Okay, so love this for me in general. I think instead of having this color, I want, I want purple. You saw that, right? Yeah, let's do purple. I like it. And then this one, what's, what's the rug that it is already? Let's use the sun rug. I like that one better. Okay. So let's, let's just start experimenting with stuff. First of all, this is our, oh, dang it. Sorry. I forgot. We got Regine. <laughs> Let me get the pet stuff. You know, I don't want her to leave. Pets. Let's get her a big old cat tree because my girl is spoiled. Also, yeah, hold on. Let, let, one thing at a time, Vanessa, one thing at a time. Big cat tree, put that in here. Um, I also wanna put a cat something in here. So when we're hanging out in here, she can hang out in here as well. Let's turn on move objects. Again, I've got better build by, so I'm able to just turn on and off move objects with the check of a button, which is great. Okay, so we've got that. Um, she needs food. Let's 
give her some food here and then she needs a litter box let's get the fancy one so i don't have to clean up here we go uh anything else for my girly we'll fill up the food okay wait all right so we'll do that and yeah oh my gosh i hate when i press the button okay so i've got most of the packs i've got almost all the packs except for batu and vampire so we're just gonna play uh let me let me offer friendship or something let me just make sure she's cool we're gonna play and see like what the potential is with all the different packs and stuff and i don't know just kind of wing it now we do live in oasis springs so let us check it out really quickly it's eight in the morning i don't know where to go oh my gosh there's like a bridge over here i have quite literally never explored this world now i think i just unpaused the game so maybe it's going to take a second for things to spawn look at me look at me here <laughs> we've already got something all right so we're gonna have her come over here and dig Oh, this is unfortunate because it's hot. She's not wearing a new outfit. Well, I tried. Y'all were there. We gave her an outfit. This this world is so nice. I have never explored this part of Oasis Springs. The kids library close to the door. I hate that one. Oh, yeah, yeah I did. You know what? I did notice that I didn't do anything. <laughs> okay, so we acquired the gemology skill. Is there anything else around here? What do, what do we have growing? A strawberry bush? Oh, that's fun. Also, the, the season I chose was summer because I didn't want to deal with, I just didn't want to deal with it. You know how it is in The Sims with the weather. Look at all this stuff out here. This is so nice. We got lemons and stuff. Okay, let me act like I've played this game before. Um. Okay, so that was the edge of that boundary. Anything on this side? I don't know. There's somebody out here fishing. Okay, let's just get in here and let's just start making some stuff. So we're gonna design jewelry. I'm gonna use, whoa, what's happening here? Raw ring, okay. Let's make this chunky necklace. We just got this romantium and then we can use any of this stuff. So I have not looked at everything that I hate that they change into hot weather clothes. <laughs> like I didn't tell them, be hot. <laughs> yeah, and that's why, I don't know if you've ever noticed me like really in Create a Sim, but I will use the same outfits. Like I will literally make the same exact outfit as an everyday outfit for hot weather because I'm like, I liked that outfit. So if you're gonna change into something for hot weather, it should be the thing that I put you in, you know? Uh, okay, so how do we wanna do this? Do we wanna go through every one? that we have here. So Orange Topaz gains creative skills faster. Um, more likely create masterpieces. Won't experience wider's block. Take longer to burn out. Peach, relationships with family members increase. Angry moodlets fade. Sapphire, Sims gain mental skills faster. Let's just, let me just rapid fire. Um, Emerald, career, and school chance cards are more likely to succeed. With Rose, Sims get over breakups faster. Uh, let's see here. Turquoise, Sims game charisma skills faster. And this one has a uh, friendly social. So I have used Turquoise and Peach in gameplay. Peach with the angry moodlet. I'll, I have opinions on that. There's some cross pack features. What you know? Share what you know. What do you mean cross pack? Go ahead, let me know. Uh, alabaster, angry air, embar there, there's so much here. There's so much here. Scared mullets fade much faster. Citrine, Sims, fan randomly find simoleons doing things around the house. What does doing things around the house mean? Like cleaning, using the bathroom? I don't know. Jade. Sims will randomly find crystals doing things around the house. Again, this doing things around the house. Quartz, they gain double satisfaction points when completing wants or aspirations. Ruby, 
Embarrassed moodlets will fade much faster. Sims will not have uncomfortable romantic interactions and they will not have awkward woohoo encounters. I'm gonna show y'all something else too that I figured out. Okay, amethyst. Sims gain energy faster when sleeping and Sims have a higher chance to wake up with an inspired lucid dream moodlet. Okay, so when I filmed my episode today of Crystal Magic, I used amethyst. Dope, amethyst is dope. Uh, hematite, if charged, oh, Sims can't die, lols. Again, I've seen other Simmers use that and you know, TBD. Okay, Simonite. Ow, dang it. Sims gain work or school performance faster and complete homework faster. I like that. Fire Opal, more successful with romantic socials, completes dates more successfully. Guys, this, gameplay wise, this unlocks a whole other opportunity to just hack the Sims, to be perfectly frank. Uh, Shinalite. Sims are more likely to give birth to twins or triplets. Moonstone, bored moodlets disappear faster. Spellcaster Sims are most, more successful with casting spells and brewing potions. Werewolf Sims Fury will build slower and rampages end faster. Amazonite, Sims excavating in Selvadorada will unearth rarer and more valuable artifacts. Diamond, they are less likely to develop relationship fears, less, they have less romantic relationship decay and will always succeed at apologizing in bed, which I think that one's hilarious. Amethyst is, is dope because it's our birth, birthstone and the thing that it does is super cool. Yes. Um, uh, Sim with clandestine, Sims are easier to convince and more likely to lend money. And with nightlight, they, the energy needs to decay slower and Sims alien powers recharge faster. And then there's these rarer ones, which we should try to find. Um, but I won't, okay, will they tell us what they do? Oh, they do. Jet, Sims can summon the Grim Reaper, Jonquilist, Sims Funny doesn't decay, Rainbows, uh, they have the Brave Reward trait benefits, Alexandrite wants refresh more often. Now, do y'all play with your wants and fears on? Let me know. Um, you love that the crystals have a purpose now besides the Get Famous hel helmet, which I have never used. I have never used that helmet. Uh, Plumbite, Sims needs increase slowly over time and they will make others around them happy. And Amber, they will not fail at interactions, won't start a fire when cooking. The weather will become sunny. Yeah, this is the one. Um, you keep them on. Okay, maybe I'll turn them on. I'll turn them on right now. Uh, okay, we're gonna use Orange Topaz cause that one, they get creative skills faster and we're trying to like blitz through this gemology skill. Also, let me see real quick. Is it under gameplay? <sighs> Show wants and fears. I'm gonna turn this on. I obviously I never played with this. And let's save. We did a lot today. I don't wanna lose it. Okay. Oh, look at her. She already got a want. What is this? Become inspired. Girl, listen to soul music. Girl. Do we have a little thing in here? <laughs> I can give her some soul music. Hold on, let me. <laughs> Y'all know my favorite little item is the um, the little speakers. I wish that you could click on them and like control the house, you know, like they were little um, HomePod type things. Does this not go up here? I can't put this on my little desk. Oh wait, where's the gemology thing? That's where I want to put it. No, so, explain. What? what? <sighs> This one is so annoying. Why doesn't this go on anything? Oh, I guess I could put it on a little nightstand here. This one is the one from Growing Together. This one's from high school years. Anyway. We'll turn on some soul music for my girl. Oh.
the welcome wagons here. Who's here? Johnny Zest. Uh, let me do a howdy introduction. Hold on, before you go and make the jewelry. Howdy him. <laughs> okay, all right, let's go back. Sorry, I, I canceled it just so I could tell him howdy. Okay, uh, orange topaz, cool. All right, Johnny. So, oh yeah, so then for this, we have the the gemology skill, I mean the, the aspiration. We have to collect five crystals or metals and gift jewelry or successfully propose with a crafted ring. If you stick around, I'll gift you this chunky, chunky necklace. Uh, okay, so she's hitting herself in the face. And all, what does this say? Make something greater than poor quality. I think she's gonna do that. Oh. <laughs> What's the song that's playing? Okay, Mason is really hurting herself. And Regine apparently is obsessed with something. Sorry, Ra I, I don't want Regine to run away, but I'm also not here for Regine. You know what I'm saying? I heard the music better a second ago. What's going on? There it is. <laughs> this is I, I love sims dang it regine she's skittish and she's got a fear oh my goodness i can't okay what does she make all right so we've got our first thing of jewelry very interesting colors i'll say that off the bat with the romantium and the orange topaz uh okay oh you know what this is what i want to figure out can we put this on here no no you see you see what i mean i can't even click on this the little bust i can wear it we can list it on popsy we can sell it if i put it in here i don't know where she got robot salvage parts i think it's when she was looking at the metal and if i yeah Okay, anyway, we're, let's gift this to Johnny Zest. What? Why do we have a negative thing with Johnny Zest? We just met him. Oh, he's in my house. Maybe my cat's scared of Johnny. You better like that, Johnny. Oh, he's wearing it. <laughs> he put it on immediately. All right, Johnny. Go off, I guess. Uh, Mason, I don't know what you think you're doing, but you're not gonna, you know, sit here and relax. I know that's for sure. Let's look for some more stuff because we gotta collect some more stuff. Anything out here? Oh, I see. So I don't know if you saw in the um in the thing, but apparently when you look at these little rocks, it tells you what you're gonna get. So this one in the gameplay walkthrough. So this one's gonna have fossils and little bones and stuff. So I don't care about that. Uh, actually, Nick, I'm seeing your comment here. Yeah, that's what, I, that's what I mean. It seems like it just is decoration and you can't actually put something on it. But it specifically says in the description that you can display your masterpieces. So does anyone know? See, it says, let your crafted necklaces dazzle against this linen bust modeled after Princess Cordelia herself. And it says environment one, but I don't know. We're also gonna design random jewelry. Let's do that really quickly. Okay, Johnny's leaving, bye. Okay, so we reached level two. We can now discuss crystal properties with other Sims and can design delicate jewelry and cut emerald gemstones at the gemology table. Okay, so this is good. 
So the next one that we do, we'll put it on Plopsy. Now what's wrong with you? She needs to go to the bathroom? No you don't. I'm gonna be real, I'm just gonna cheat needs. We're, we're trying to figure out what we can make here. So what did we make? We made a raw necklace with flamingonium and simonite. So if charged, we gain work or school performance faster and we complete homework faster. Great. How much is this worth? 279, so we lost money on this. Thanks, thanks Mason. All right, well, let's make something else. Oh, okay, we learned something else. If you make, okay, sorry, let me, how, how can I say this? Even if you don't collect the metal, if it's the first time you're using it, I guess it counts as collecting the metal. Okay, so we've already reached gemology level three. I don't know about y'all, but this to me, this skill seems to move very quickly. We're now likely to find, we're more likely to find crystals and metals when digging at rocks, and we can design lunar goddess jewelry and cut seed shaped gemstones at the table. So that's gonna be the next thing we do because that little seed, um, that crystal tree takes forever. All right, what'd you make? You made another chunky necklace? with Alcron and Shinolite. Okay. So let's click on this. Let's list it on Plopsy. It's gonna cost us five simoleons. We'll list both of these on Plopsy. Oh, see this one was worth even less. And then we're gonna cut a seed shaped gemstone and we're gonna just cut it out of whatever because it doesn't matter which crystal we use for that. Oh, and then look, she uses this section instead of using the middle section. Oh, she didn't list this one on Popsy. Oh, 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 okay, wait, it's eight o'clock. So between seven and seven, we can charge. It is a new moon, so they're not gonna charge very fast, but I'm going to put that little necklace on there and it says it's charging. Charging slowly due to the new moon. It's gonna be 12 hours until it's fully charged. And so it's not gonna get fully charged today, but I'm gonna at least put it on there. His parents hate him. I don't think, I, I don't know if it's connected on the right way on his family tree. Uh, okay, so how is she doing? And then after this, regardless, let's go around and look for some more stuff. Oh no. Oh, how are you doing, Regine? I will survive. We'll pet her afterward. I don't want to scare her. We'll pet her and her, we'll talk to her. Soul Station is lit. Someone said they like the alternative station. Let's try that. I don't know what it's playing right now, but it's playing something. She's almost done. Aha! Here we go. So we've made the seed shaped gemstone. Cool. She's talking to Regine. I'm gonna move this outside because, where do we wanna put this? No, it's, it's in midair. Now why would I want that? Why would I want that Sims? Let me turn off move objects cause it's tripping. Here we go. Okay, I want this in the front here. So we'll plant this. Cause it's gonna take forever. It's Sunday. I think it's like once it's um, again, maybe next Sunday. So let's see how fast we can get through a week. Okay, she acquired the gardening skill. Water that please. Uh, and now it's dark. Uh, we can try to go somewhere and look for more crystals, but now it's gonna be dark. So let's go here. <laughs> Imagine bringing Johnny with us, like, no thank you. No thank you. Oh, we got more wants. Uh, experience power from a charged crystal. We'll, we'll lock that. Become confident and play chess. Girl. You know what, actually, go ahead. Come over here and play chess because we gotta wait for these things to um, load in. Now, this area definitely has a lot of little rocks and stuff that we can dig up. I'm just gonna wait for them to populate. Oh, I see. 
I'm not actually trying to leave. I was just trying to rotate. Okay, so I'm seeing the rocks uh, come in. So I see this one looks like it's a fossil. It's like, stop wasting my time. I don't want no dang fossils. This one looks like a metal. So I'm gonna have her come over here and dig that. This one is also a metal. We'll dig this. And then we finally have a crystal over here. So we'll dig that. Stop playing chess. This is not what we're here for. Okay. So she found flamingonium and phosnite and moonstone. Yay. Okay, cool. Um, is there anything else? Let me zoom out. So yeah, so I don't know, it's it's coming to the different locations and trying to find little dig spots, basically. The rocks with stuff on them. She's finding a lot of metals. We're having a lot of luck digging up metals. And I'm not sure though about the crystals. Okay, what's this? That's a little fossil. It has little bones. I know it's hard to see now that it's dark. Uh, but we'll travel somewhere else too. She found more flamingonium. Okay, let's travel to... Oh wait, where, where am I going? Uh, I w let's travel here to the lounge. We could probably meet some people and also look for crystals. You can find a ruby through fishing. Let's try it. She can't fish, you know what I mean? She just, she's just existing in this little sim world. Anybody here? Who are you? You are vibing by yourself. To what is Sims music? Do you hear this? He is getting it to the Sims 2 music. <laughs> you know what, you dance too. Yeah, go off. <laughs> Mason, she's like, oh yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, all right, this is, we didn't come here to hang out though. We can't, oh wait, now what do you want? She wants to, she's like, let's have a drink. Well, you might as well. Where is everybody? Nobody likes to hang out on a Monday evening or a Monday morning. Let me order a drink. Let's order some wine. Wow, she's been out and looking for crystals and stuff all night because the sun's coming back up. Ooh, look at this. I see a crystal little thing. I wonder if the same things spawn in the same places. You know, like if we come back here tomorrow, will will this spot have a crystal again? And what else? I'm gonna speed it up time because she needs to come back out. There's a lot of fishing spots around here, so we can try fishing for crystals. What what happened? She found Jonquilist. Oh, and she's going to the bathroom. Yeah, do that. Take care of yourself. Since I'm clearly not doing the best job. Uh, what's this? We found some more metal. Dang, she's finding all this metal. I want crystals. Oh, look. Found another crystal over here. Sims 2 theme. Good old days. That's what I'm saying. That's why I, I couldn't even really be mad. I was like, I do like this music. <laughs> Maybe not to dance to in a lounge, but still. Okay, this is the edge of the world. And then, yeah, maybe she'll come back over here. Let's try fishing. So she's looking for more metals. We, oh, we found death metal. And she reached gemology level four. So she can cut um pear shaped gemstones and she can design eye jewelry uh oh she took up a capsule what that was supposed to be crystals i didn't want a capsule you wasted my time 
All right. We also have our jewelry listed on Plopsy. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, for some reason, she got earbuds. I don't know what that's from. We're probably gonna have to take care of her needs too. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Sometimes The Sims is like so picturesque. Like it's sparkling water with like a waterfall off in the distance. This is so nice. All right, we're trying, we're fishing for crystals. Juice community is in the lead. I think everyone's gonna be walking around drunk. Looks like the fish in this area are too crafty for Mason. Well, and then we found a little Lindsay doll. All right, well, I guess anything over here that we can get? No. What's, what's in here? You got any food? Ooh, let's get a hot dog. Cause she's hungry. And then we'll go home, we'll make some more jewelry. Oh, she's just gonna stand there and eat it? I was wondering if she would sit down. No, she's not going to, of course not. Here, come over here and sit. She's not feeling too great. What's this thumbs down? She's mad about what? Having a bad time. <sighs> Having a bad time what? Do you dislike, do you, do you not like fishing? Did I say dislikes fishing? Cause if so, that's hilarious. Y'all, I put that she dislikes fishing. That's really funny. I don't even know if I dislike fishing, but I was like, yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> All right, girl, go home. Okay. Okay, so we're back. Um, can you come over here and, and make some more stuff? So let's cut a gemstone. Let's cut, ooh, a pear-shaped gemstone with our, what does this do? Fun need doesn't decay. Tense mood lets go away faster. Yeah, let's do that one. I think this is the gist. This is the gist of the gameplay. It's like, sit at this table and find crystals and different things that they do. Now we can use any crystal that we want. Oh, that's what I wanted to show you guys. So these little, the household collections, I figured this out today. Uh, now we have the metals and crystals. I don't know what this plus one means. Interesting. So it looks like, okay. Even if we make jewelry, using the crystals like that we buy it won't pop up here so only the ones that we actually find will pop up in here so that was good to learn so all that we found is the junquilist and the moonstone oh that's the heat wave Ooh, hopefully she's okay are you okay this is her bed i wish we had found some amethyst Although it wouldn't have been charged, so it's fine. Minerva. I called and inform you. Yeah, sure, I'll take some free money. I don't need it. But yeah. Uh, okay. The only thing this is missing to me in this gameplay is a little alert that tells you that they finished. So she's finished this pear shaped gemstone. I'm just gonna drag it out here. Okay. I'm gonna drag it out here to this little crystal grid. It's 7 p.m. so now things are starting to charge. So it says it's five hours until it's fully charged and this will be two hours until it's charged. And then when she gets up, ooh, look, our crystal tree is starting to sprout. Okay, so we need to use the bathroom. Go ahead, go use the bathroom. 
And I think we need to say hi to the cat. No, I told you to use the bathroom. Oh, she can't get there? Why can't you get there? Is it because I put this, the little cat thing in the way? You can't be serious. It's the doors, the doors are too wide. Okay, now go to the bathroom. Sims. There's a lot of possibilities combining the crystals and metals, yes. So let's, after she takes care of her needs, which I could cheat them again, but we might as well just take a quick little intermission for her to make something. I don't wanna cook. I just wanna have a meal. Is it because it's 3 a.m.? Let's have some cheese crackers, I guess. It's not a real meal, but that's something. So she'll have some cheese crackers and then let's design some more jewelry. Let's design, so the best thing that we can make, I think is down here. Lunar goddess ring. We found this death metal. Oh, and the moonstone. I think this would be pretty together. Oh, she wanted to eat food. I really, maybe I should turn on the wants and whatnot because it's easy points. Oh, we have to wear a fully charged piece. Okay, good to know. Do we have anything that's fully charged out here? Raw necklace, fully charged. Okay. And then what about this? Is this fully charged? Fully charged. Okay, I'm gonna put this out near her and she should experience the effects of fun's need doesn't does not decay like at all and tense mood lets fade away so what do we have here Ow. everlasting oh. <clears throat> excuse me everlasting oh. merriment huh. from being nearby this crystal and then look the fun need just isn't going oh it's, it's going up apparently oh that's interesting i didn't know it was going up i thought it just wouldn't decay no matter where it was uh -huh. that's really neat so she's very happy. And then when she's done, instead of selling this, we will wear this with our current outfit. So as far as level one, we were supposed to buy a crystal grid, which we already did. Wear fully, wait, this is level one? No, this is level two. Level one was buy a gemology table, collect five crystals and gift jewelry. So at level two, bobble broker, we needed to buy a crystal grid, wear a fully charged jewelry piece, and plant a seed, which we're about to wear the fully charged piece, and then we'll move on to level three. Okay, so then we have to grow a magnificent crystal tree, make five pieces of excellent jewelry, and complete crafting gemstones or jewelry 10 times while focused. Now that one, th this seems difficult. What's what's the fourth level? Legendary lap lapid wait, lapidary? Legendary lapidary? What's a lapidary? Cut a gemstone valued at 2,500 simoleons, achieve level 10 of the gemology skill, summon the Grim Reaper with a, with jet gemstone or jewelry. Okay, we may not get to all this today. I am trying to play through this on my, on my um, my let's play but yeah okay so uh, can i get any closer to this it's so it's so small it's, it's hard to tell what the colors and stuff look like i probably should have used these crystals and stuff with a larger piece but this is a cute little piece of jewelry uh and it has moonstone all right you know what that means let's try to list this on pop plopsy list on plopsy so the first thing that we have on Plopsy, it says expiration time is Thursday. We don't have any offers yet, so we're just waiting. And then for the ring, expiration time is Saturday, and we don't have any buyers yet. So we're just we're just trying to 
made that go. Oh, what's this? Fertility boost. Oh, oh, right. That's what this is. Nah, take this off. <laughs> remove, remove this. We're gonna list this on Plopsy too. I don't need this. Somebody else does. All right, it's six in the morning. Let's go hunting for crystals. Make a proposal ring and find a romantic interest for your sim. Done. Done. We can figure it out. What's this? Is this far from where we live? It's some residential lot on this side, which I haven't been to before. Let's come over here. Oh, it's green. It's green over here. Arid Ridge. Ooh. Um, I don't know if anything will spawn in this area, but I did want to check it out. Oh, here you go again. Let me order a drink. As a matter of fact, who, who are you? Julia Wright? Let's talk to Julia. Do a funny introduction. Isn't she the sin that comes with like the university or whatever? Oh my God, Mason in her little outfit with her little booties. So cute. Uh, okay. Friendly. Share ideas. Oh, she's she's also working. Mm. Uh, am I, is she hungry or anything? No. All right. Uh, okay, y'all keep chit-chatting, I guess. I'm gonna go start looking for some crystals. Make some small talk. Talk about the, the weather. <laughs> the girl's in danger. Uh, okay, so let's see. What's this? Oh, it's a light. I was like, what is that? Uh, okay. Does anything spawn in this area? Let's find out. I see some more metals, so we can get this, dig up that. What else do we have out here, anything? This is a very nice gated little community with like a little golf, I guess. We have some more metals. We are really lucking it up today with metals, not as much with crystals. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a, just a little bit disappointed but that won't stop me. Yeah, I see some more rocks. I don't want rocks. Not those kind of rocks anyway, I want crystals. We'll try fishing again. What do we have here? Dang it, more fossils. I mean, I guess we can try to dig that up. I don't think it's anything, like, I don't think it's like secretly something else. Anything over here? Last time we dug up a crystal too, it ended up being like a time capsule or something stupid. She found Fosanite and robot salvage parts. Them finding the, the upgrade parts are hilarious to me. Okay, let's, where is she? <laughs> Visa, get somebody else to do it. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. We, I guess we should, we should check because I'm gonna be mad if we get something good in there, but I am like 90% sure it won't be anything that we want. Here, come over and dig this up. This is a beautiful neighborhood though. I will say that. I don't explore in The Sims enough. We got Ozenold. The metals don't do anything. They're just there for like colors but they don't do anything specific. Oh no, she's getting uncomfortable. Don't die. Let me have her change. Okay, now she's feeling good. Yeah, we found fall. That's what I'm saying. We didn't. We don't want a fossil. Mm -hmm. We want a crystal. Hmm. Okay. All right, well, this is a bust. Let's come on, let's go fishing real quick. Let's just double check that we can't get a crystal from fishing. Come over here. Oh, and she doesn't like fishing. Well, maybe she'll change her mind today. I'm 
I do see fish at least. Yeah, now she's feeling tense. I, oh, you know what? Uh, another question I have is, do the crystals that are charged work in your inventory? Because you see how she's not having fun because she's fishing? I wonder if we had that crystal that we have charged at home in her inventory, if that would change her mind. I'm going to cheat her needs because this is just, we're doing experiments today, you know what I mean? So we don't need to feed her and all that, all that. They do, okay, cool. So she found a fish. Maybe we go home after this. We might have fishing stuff in like in our neighborhood. I think we do. Yeah, let's go home. We'll put that in the inventory and then we'll fish again. Let's see. Uh, the cat does not like our little speaker. So let's go talk to her again. I don't want her to go anywhere. Let's calm her down and let's pet. Oh, maybe we can hug. Ooh. Okay. This is still charged. Charge remaining two days. So I'm going to put this in her inventory. Uh, we have fish here. I'm just going to sell this. I don't think we need this. Okay, I just want her to just spend a little bit of time with the kitty cat. Just gonna hug the cat. Yay! Okay, so she's not having a good time. Oh, what do we have over here? Uh, more fossils. Uh, okay, so no, over here. Let's, let's see. Go fishing. What am I looking for? Yeah, okay. So the fun, hmm, fun is going, uh, is it going down? Or is nothing happening? We'll see. Says she's having a bad time for two more hours. It's 4.30. She did level up in fishing though. So even though we have our Jonquilis that is charged and it's in our inventory. What's going on? Keep fishing. Go fishing, ma'am. It looks like her fun is going down. It's going down a lot. <laughs> you forgot about the cat. I, yeah, yeah, I, I, I don't want her to run away. So yes, uh, the more she fishes, she's now angry. She's like, girl, I told you I don't like fishing. And she's tense from fishing and she's tense from low fun. So her fun went down, even though we have this in our inventory. So I would almost venture to say, he wants me to join the, the Renegades? Sure. Welcome to Renegades. You wanna join us? Sure. Why am I saying yes? Maybe to, to talk to more people and also to see if we can find some more crystals. Get us back out of here. And maybe if we're not fishing, so if we're not engaging in an activity that we don't like, what does that do for our fun? Does our fun go up? Because right now it's feeling like it doesn't do anything. So let me see. If I, let's bring this out. Can I bring this out? No. I can't place this anywhere. But she's pissed. Look at her. Very angry. Having a very, really, really bad time. She needs fun. Um, we also don't have the, the little moodlet. The moodlet that would be there. What if I put this out? So swim here. What is this? She's gonna angry swim? Okay, so now, wow, she does not, what is going on? Dislikes, how is she meeting people that she doesn't like? Also, why is she in a club with children? Who is, do you see this? Who is that? Why is Max Villarreal a child, the club leader for this group? <laughs> what is happening? Can't we just chill? She doesn't like hardworking Sims, I guess. Oh my God, do you see this? Do you see how she has all these relationships that are super negative? How is this happening? 
What is going on? Is it just because she's she's mad? Meanwhile, she's feeling the effect of the dang crystal. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, her fun is all the way back up from the crystal. I'm assuming. Maybe she likes swimming? Oh, do you see that? When I put the crystal in her inventory, the fun dropped. But if I take it back out and just leave it nearby, what happens? The fun goes back up. Interesting. So I think the crystals being in the inventory, I'm not sure if it's helping us or not. Also, I'm gonna be real with y'all. I'm not, we're, I, can I leave? How do I leave this group? Oh, I pressed the button. Oh, I'm getting a spinning wheel of death. Okay, I don't want to do this. I, I don't want to do any of this. I just want to leave. No. I'm going to end the gathering. I don't care about y'all. Yeah, cancel membership. I don't want to be in that club. Sorry, the kid, the kid being the leader of the club really turned me off there. Uh, all right, so we learned a lot. I learned a lot about how it works with the inventory. It's not helping. Now I do know that there is, okay. But we're, we're done swimming. Did you know that? We're going home. Let's go make some more crystals and charge, charge some things. Now that it's nine o'clock at night. Where's our house? Over here. The way I've never played on this lot. Oh, you know, we could try. We could try some like romantic crystals and try to see if, if Julia's into us or not. Uh, all right, come over here. Cut, let's design some jewelry. We're gonna need jewelry. Uh, the eye, oh, I like this one. The delicate necklace. We found Osnold, we have Fosnite. We've got a lot of, a lot of metals. So now with the crystals. Angry moodlets will fade faster. I don't think we need that though. I think hopefully she'll be over whatever's going on with her in a second. Social need doesn't decay. Which one is gonna help us with like romance? Ruby? This one. It's gonna be like red and gold. Excuse me, Sims will not have uncomfortable romantic interactions. That's what we're gonna try. We also have a first quarter moon. So I think that it'll help us with charging our crystals. I'm also gonna put my little thing out. Okay, so we still have our jewelry that's being listed on Plopsy. No movement there yet, but we're still working on it. The cat still doesn't like my thing, my speaker, but that's fine. Okay. Mason can now craft jewelry and gemstones faster and can design bling jewelry. And she can cut brilliant cut gemstones on the gemology table, great. So we're at level five. That's basically what just happened here. She's also hungry. I wanna find that plum bite. Windenburg is so big. Windenburg is my favorite neighborhood. It really is. Okay, what do we get here? Ooh. Okay, first of all, can you wear real clothes? Let's change into our everyday, thank you. Second of all, oh, we gotta charge it first. Okay, okay, okay. So, let's bring this out here. Now that we have a first quarter moon, six hours till charging. So if we leave this here and we stay here all night, it will be charged by the time we get to the morning. So let us design, let's design some random jewelry actually. Design something random. Can you queue up? stuff to do so if i get this and uh oh yeah the amethyst remember when i said that i wanted to get an amethyst i like this shape let's do that oh okay so you can queue up you can queue up gemstone and jewelry but i can't queue up multiple jewelries it looks like oh my god regime this would be this is me in real life whenever i'm on my computer trying to work my cat's looking at me like, are you almost done? <laughs> Yay, look at this. So cute, what did we make? We made death metal with jade. Sims will randomly find crystals doing things around the house. Oh, oh, do we have time to charge this? I don't think we do. It won't be fully charged. It needs six hours. Oh, dang. If you leave the lot, doesn't 
does it stop charging? So you said, nope, it keeps charging. All right, let's go. Let's figure it out. Um, stop this. So right now it says that it's four hours until fully charged. So let's go somewhere else. Let's see. So in theory, if we're out till seven o'clock, when we come back, it should be charged. Where do we wanna go? We can go back to that lounge. Oh, let's go to another world. Let's look for some more crystals and stuff. If we're gonna go out, we might as well try. Um, does Newcrest have anything? I don't have anything in Newcrest, so I don't wanna go to Newcrest. Let's go to the park in, uh, whatchamacallit. What is this? What's this world called? <laughs> what is this? What is the main world, y'all? <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> uh, okay. Come over here. Come over here and skate. Skate around. Ooh, let's customize. We can set the music. Oh, yeah. We can go back to listening to, um, let's listen to some hip hop. Set effects. I want sparkles. And let's change the lighting to twinkles. Oh yeah, this is dope. Oh, she needs to go to the bathroom. When she comes over here, I'm gonna cheat her needs again. She got no friends. That's the one thing about being a new Sim. Let me cheat your need. Let's make you happy. Look how cute she looks skating around in her Crystal Creations little outfit. <laughs> oh my gosh, you know what? Strangerville has some spawning spots. Oh, bet. Let's go. We'll go after this. Willow Creek. Oh my gosh. <laughs> China, I'm so sorry. I don't know why I blinked out so like that. I really did though. I did not remember. <laughs> okay. Um, love this, love this for her. Now I know there's some spots because I was looking through this when I did my uh, Let's Play episode. Boom, look at this, baby. Finally, some crystals. Can we find something that's more rare? Uh, okay, so while she goes looking for that, where else do we have some spawning spots? Ugh, the dang fossils. It's like Sims be wasting my time. I do not care about that. What is that even for? Like the archaeology skill? Is that who wants the fossils? Oh, she found Plumbite. Wait, she found Plumbite. Is that the one? Y'all, yeah. that's the one. That's the one. S your needs increase slowly over time. Sims will make other Sims around them happy. This is the one that will just fill your needs. Bet, 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 bet. I am so happy that we found that one and it's super rare. So we're just gonna cut that as like a regular gemstone and just have it hanging around. Oh look, we I found another crystal. So, so this gameplay also, right? Like looking around for crystals and metals. I think I do like this because this is something that I honestly did not pay attention to in the game before this. And we always were able to collect crystals and stuff, but there was no reason to. Oh, look, we found Amber. Sims won't start a fire when cooking. Oh, you know what we can do? We can charge that one and then we can, um, just leave that in the kitchen because you know she she don't have any cooking skill so i haven't had her make anything one because i've been cheating her needs but two because i i haven't wanted her to start a fire who are you uh you're sadie let me go let me just say hello friendly introduction i just you know just making sure my neighbors know who i am uh okay where are you going i'm literally coming over to say hi uh, okay, I guess she decided she's not. Oh, I guess I am on the other side of the park. Who's this? Someone's coming. Okay. All right. Well, that was that was a fail. Anything else around here? We can go pop, pop by Strangerville. Oh, is that a girl, Julia? Uh, hey, Julia. 
Oh, she looks pregnant. I only said that because she had like a little, she looked like she was about to throw up and she had a little, um, the little baby thing, Hillary. Is Hillary pregnant when we, she came with the My Wedding Stories pack, right? Okay, so Mason, can you like be a little less awkward? Can you imagine? Dag, dag. Oh, look, she said bye. Cause she keeps catching Julia when Julia's about to work. Hillary seems nice though. Hillary came over to actually talk to me. I'll tell you a funny story. Oh, discuss crystal properties. Let's also talk about that. Like, yeah, I'm into crystals. That's basically all I've done. Me and my cat regime, you know, hanging out. And Hillary's like, oh, that's very fascinating. Would you do a legacy challenge? <gasps> Maybe. What do you mean a legacy challenge? Like my own made up legacy challenge or like a not so berry type of challenge? You know what I did see that I actually am interested in? Um, did you see that Deligracy came up with a new uh, challenge? The tiny, what did you call it? The tiny world or the tiny um, neighborhood or something challenge? It looked really cute. I watched her video on that the other day and that is one that I actually want to try and that might be one I try on stream. All right, so the next thing we're gonna go to, you said Strangerville has some good spots. The only thing, Strangerville is just so creepy when you haven't played through the thing. Uh, all right, let's go to the library. Is that where we should go? The library or the bar? Is this a library? Let's go to the bar first. The Tiny Town Challenge. Yes, that one looks really cute. And that, I'm like, that looks fun. Now, and yes, and it does look creative. Cause when she started the video and she's like, oh, it's inspired by like Stardew Valley and, and those kind of games. I had never played those games. So I kind of was like, oh, you know, like where is this, where is she going with this? And then when she explained it, I was like, oh, that's super cute. Here's the thing. I need to stop hitting on people who are like at work. You know what I mean? And I'm not hitting on anybody. I'm not hitting on anybody. I'm just, I'm just kind of introducing myself. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not hitting on anyone, but just just talking to people who are supposed to be doing their job, it's a little, it's a lot. Now what are you, what are you wearing? Who is this? Mila Munch. And then who's this? Oh, Lily Fang. Why don't we like Lily? How did this happen? Uh, let me enthuse about hip, the hip hop, hippie. Hippie to the hip hip hop. You don't stop. Oh, yeah. I'm also gonna do some small talk with the bartender. I'm gonna get to know the bartender. They should be more innately friendly, you know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh, and she's already feeling a little flirty. She's materialistic. That's not, that's not the best. Uh, is she leaving? Oh, she's going to judge the decor of the chair. Sims? Can I share my ideas with you? What's your name again? Alex, Alex Moyer. Who did Alex come with? I've been playing something similar to, uh, similar with the new town, the new in town scenario. Some people are doing the tiny town challenge. I saw a couple of videos. Okay, okay. Yeah, I think that one, that one is was such a good idea, and she already set up a lot and everything. So truly, I might just download that and make a couple Sims, and we can do that on stream together because that just sounds like enough silliness and chaos or whatever going on that could be fun. But then legacy wise, I do have my Winters family, and so the Winters family I think is the family that I would think would be closest to like me doing a legacy challenge. The idea was that I was going to oh. Okay, I'm starting to see some things spawn. So I hope you got to know Alex because we might hit her up later. Otherwise, let's let's get back to work, Mason. So I've got uh, Cameron and uh, Megan. They're a married couple. And I've got uh, Megan's sister, Angelica. So I don't know if you saw on my, my channel, I had my Nectar Empire Let's Play. That was with Angelica. Oh, look, there's some more stuff over here too. Great, great. Um, I think I am envisioned that the Winters family would be my legacy family. Uh, I'm, I haven't picked an heir that yet though, cause I've just been having fun playing with them as a family unit, but I'm kind of starting to get to a point where I'm like, one, there's too many Sims in that house. And two, it's just time to move on. I'm gonna have to turn aging on and just kind of start letting people get old and die out or whatever, but I have to decide who the heir might be. I'm thinking, 
definitely continuing with the winters. I just don't stream enough. I'm only streaming once a week and I know I need to up my streaming y'all. I know I need to do that. Um, oh look, we've got some more stuff right here. Oh no, it's fossil, dang it. They're hitting me with these fossils. Okay, we'll dig it up, but I'm not happy about it. I think I want Autumn to be the next heir for that family. I think I want to focus on Autumn, the tw like of the twins, Autumn and Aaliyah. They just aged up into teenagers. And I think that could be fun. It was either Autumn or I was going to focus on Apple. One of the one of those two I was going to focus on in the next round. I was going to do Archie. Originally, when I first started playing with them, Archie was going to be my focus. But then he ended up having the evil trait. And I, don't, I just don't want to play with an evil sim. I'm playing with an evil sim with Malcolm um, with the, the, the Slumlord Stories Let's Play. And, I, and that's enough. You know what I mean? So yeah, so eventually I will age up the winters and we will keep playing with them. Uh, and then as far as like a legacy challenge as part of like a pre-recorded Let's Play, I would say that that is a maybe. I don't know, there's a there's just so much that I can do. And it, I don't know, I, I've only had the channel for a year. You know what I mean? Like, so if I pace myself, I think I just, there's so many ideas that I can explore over the coming years. If this is something that like y'all are still interested in and I'm still interested in and we're having fun with this, then eventually I will have to do a legacy just because, you know, that's just par for the course. Okay, we need to try another neighborhood, I think. Um, what's this, a little tuft of grass? I think some of the things that are spawning in here right now are the dang Strangerville stuff that I don't want. Let me just press play. We can go to the other neighborhood in this world too and just see like people live here. Eclectic Arts Household. And who lives here? They have a horse? I was like, that didn't come that didn't come with the them. I don't know when they downloaded that. This is a cute house. Hi, I'm a neighbor. I live in um, Oasis Springs. Let me do a, I don't know why I chose a respectful introduction, but sure. Let me knock on the door. This is a cute house. Oh, I like the way that they have the like planks in front of here. Okay, don't get stuck talking outside. Are you gonna go knock on the door? Mm, I don't think I wanna do anything with that. Okay, I'm gonna let things load in real quick. You know what'd be funny is if sometimes you'd knock on the door and they'd be like, nah, we don't want you in here. <laughs> uh, let me do a friendly introduction to you as well. <laughs> wow, the TV is up really high in here. I'm being enthused about music. Okay, so it's 10 o'clock. You can buy crystals in the realm of magic. First of all, why are you coming for me like that? You know I'm, I'm figuring this out, all right? I, I'm, I'm trying to figure out, one, where, what different places we can go to try to like find crystals and not just buy it. And then two, yeah, we can go over there and check. I'm gonna go back to the house because I wanna see if our thing's charged. But I'm just checking around here if anything spawned in. This Strangerville as a neighborhood is very pretty. If you don't have Strangerville, to me, it's worth getting because when you play through the Strangerville like situation, um, I think it's a great neighborhood to have. It reminds me of the one of the neighborhoods from Sims 2, the deserty one. I think that I thought the deserty one was supposed to be like Oasis Springs, but this one reminds me more of it. Okay. See, this is what I'm talking about. This this is why I didn't want to come out here because this is so creepy. Oh, Julia's, Julia's calling me y'all. Julia's calling to crash with me. Okay. What an odd 
What an odd. How long are you gonna be with me? Through the weekends? Okay. Sure. Uh, all right, let's go to the realm of magic. Can we go there if we're not a spellcaster? Actually, no, we're not going to the realm of magic. We're going home. That's where we're actually going. We're going home because we need to check to see if this stuff charged. You played with it with Dream Home Decorator. Ooh, I like that house. That was nice. I might kick them out uh, for some play. Oh, for, so, for something that I do. Okay, I was worried for a second that it was like gonna be Julia and people, but it looks like it's not. So, okay, it did charge. It did charge. And for some reason, we only have two hours remaining for this with the Jade. And then this one, this one is the one that I wanted to try to hit on Julia with. So let's see, can we, what is this? It, yeah, this one here, wear with all outfits. Can we see it on her? Wow, what, uh, this is a very, striking piece of jewelry it doesn't go with her earrings but just pretend like she's not wearing those earrings oh look she's in a flirty mood ruby 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 mason navigates romantic escapades with grace evading embarrassment and awkward woohoo encounters oh julia i know you're feeling vulnerable that's why you're coming to talk to me but i'm gonna try out this crystal Oh, this is embarrassing. I've got this like dirty bowl of cheese crackers just out when she's staying with me. Uh, is it too on the nose to discuss crystal properties with her? Okay, so I welcomed her. Uh, okay. Um, and I'm also asking her about something. Ask about love life. I'm gonna share ideas. All right, it says kiss hands. Let's let's take it easy. I'm gonna flirt with her and see if she responds well with that. Cause I don't know what her like romantic preferences are. Pick up line. I, I like the necklace with the romper though. That's cute. Mason, we'd love to have you join the Renegades. No, we tried that already. Remember when the child was leaving the group and I said, no, thank you. Yeah. Uh, you're scared of that pack. What pack? Oh, the Strangerville one? Yeah. It's a, it's, yeah. One, like I said, once you play through it, I've played through it one time, and it was pretty good. Also, I like how you can exchange numbers, but she literally called me to come and stay out here. You said you think it's an awesome idea. You created your own legacy challenge and you're loving it so far and you're pacing yourself. Where can I find the information about your legacy challenge? <laughs> and then you remember the time you were gonna play Strangerville as a soap opera and spent weeks setting everything up. Then all your saves got erased. That's terrible. That is so terrible. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. That kind of thing is so devastating. You know what, just for that, let me say real quick. Also, if you are interested in winning a copy of the Crystal Creation Stuff Pack, courtesy of the EA Creator Network, please type enter in the chat. Also, if you type enter in the chat, please be prepared if you win to tell me your Instagram or your TikTok because I need to reach out to you if you win. Julia Wright left university to find crystals. <laughs> yes, yeah, so again, type enter in the chat if you're interested in winning a, the, a copy of the pack, courtesy of the EA Creator Network. And again, all of this we're doing today is because the EA Creator Network gifted me a code and because the EA Creator Network gifted me a code to give away as well. Uh, Julia, ma'am. Uh, I'm supposed to be wooing you. Julia, where'd you go? Oh my God. Okay, who are you? Dominic Crandall. <sighs> Dominic Crandall, you don't look like one of my, who, who are you? Rita C Combs, an elder? Uh... I mean, who am I? 
to say that an elder woman can't get some. You know what I'm saying? Who am I but a mere, a mere mortal? <laughs> uh, okay, so we're chatting, I guess. Oh. Give relationship advice, Carzine sure. Oh you, oh, you know what else? We have that plum bite. What am I doing? We've got some good stuff here. If Julia's not around, uh, uh, then I don't even want to waste uh, the power of the crystal on, on any uh, random person. Uh, I can discuss know. crystal properties with you. Who are you? <laughs> Actually, if Julia's not around, let's just go to the magic realm. Uh, who are you? Maybe we'll go here. We'll go to the Charm family. Mason hitting on everybody. First of all, poor happy girl. Why are you doing my girl like that? Mason is who I who I think I, you know what I'm saying? In real life, I would never do this. In Sim world, I'm like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. She's single, ready to mingle. <laughs> Physical also, this is great. I just love that this Terrific. crystal, oh, it looks wow. like, Kids it looks like one of those things, like if lot. this was an episode of like Charmed or something like that, like this would be an obvious cursed piece of jewelry that she's wearing. Oh, you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of um, Ursula. <laughs> I am flirting, flirting away. Go off, Mason. <laughs> reminds me of the manifestation video exactly i was gonna actually load up the manifestation save for this but then i was like i'll just start a new save of mason doing whatever she wants okay come over here and knock on the door oh while we're here we can take a look at some of the stuff that comes with um realm of magic and just look at it in comparison you know what i'm saying thinking about the stuff that comes with crystal creations the first of all the light that comes with this pack is crazy it's like really really big now this glass table kind of reminds me of the glass um coffee table that we got with this pack i also love this fireplace thing and how it has crystals in it i was gonna use this in my shop in my uh crystal magic shop but i ended up using the cottage living fireplace because i thought that was a better one uh, who are you even talking to? Who is, who is this? Amelia. Uh -huh. Oh, we have amazing compatibility even. Uh, Let me discuss so. crystal properties. And I'll ask you if you're single. Uh, I don't know, she, Amelia likes this. I'm gonna flirt with you. Not saying it'll be instant besties with Grimm, but a little jet can entice him to visit. What do you, uh, okay, it must be something to do with the crystal properties. I'm like, what are you even talking about? All right, well, technically I didn't come here for this. Ooh, y'all see this? <laughs> All right, well, that was enough chatting with you, Amelia. Thank you. I am here to go to the magic realm. We're gonna buy some crystals if they'll let us. Oh, this is a cute little house too. Okay, where where is it? It's uh, over the hill and through the woods. Oh, here we go, back over here over this very ominous looking cliff. Travel, travel to the magic realm. The light is a bit much, it is. And it's, it's just also very big. Oh, she found more amber. Oh yes, amber is the rare one. We have two rare crystals. The plum bite is the one that I'm like, I should have uh, cut that before we left. So that could be charging if we got back really late, but that's fine. Mm, oh. Wait, what's this? More crystal? Hold on, before you go. Don't go yet. Go dig that up. Might as well, y'all, might as well, since it's on, we're, you know, it's on our way, it's on our way. Anything else? No, is that Elphaba? Now Elphaba knows she got a glimmer stone. She ain't gotta walk like a regular person. Oh, we found Rose. Okay, now we're gonna travel back to the magic realm. Oh my God, this looks so cool back here. I've never really paid attention to this. Um, social needs does not decay. This is the ugliest house of The Sims 4. Okay. <laughs> okay, anybody else wanna enter? We've got Nick, poor happy girl, Moop, and China. 
I'm gonna do the spinning wheel and we're just gonna see who it lands on. Thankfully, I don't have so, so many people enter. Oh, enter the portal. The swirling vortex appears to lead to a realm beyond our own reality. Do you dare cross the threshold? Yes, I do dare. Um, okay, how do I wanna do this? You cannot see this, so this will be funny. Boom, in the magic realm. I've never visited as a regular person. I've only visited as um, a, a spellcaster, a witch. She's a witch. Okay, so spin the wheel. Wheel of names. Okay, so I've got Nick. I've got poor happy girl. I see Moop. Moop, is that how you say it? There's like an accent over the O. Now I know you don't need to use the bathroom. There ain't no bathrooms here. All right, so we're gonna come here. Yeah, brooms and crystals, wands, tomes, and familiars, potion ingredients. Yeah, this is what we wanna do. We're gonna come over here and haggle. Uh, who is this? Uh, excuse me? What the heck happened to Julia? Is she actually dead? No. No, something's going on. Astral projection vendor. Something's happening. I don't know what that's about. Oh my gosh. That was gonna stress me out. Okay, I got, ch I got China. Okay, this something nope oh, i can't copy the way i want to oh dang it okay. we weren't able to haggle oh my gosh okay bye brooms and crystals yeah i'm just gonna type china that's fine uh and then simply and then just for fun i'm gonna hit i'm gonna add spin again as an option I know you guys can't see this yet, but I'm gonna figure it out. Just give me a second. Okay, so Nick, poor happy girl, Moop, China, Simply. I think that is everyone. Sellers appear as jokes as ghosts in the magic realm. Okay. See, you know I was gonna be stressed out. Alright, so we have let's let's just buy one of everything. We have alabaster emeralds oh, what there's only three things here Gosh. okay now the next question is did this count so we have all these metals yeah these did count yeah alabaster emeralds turquoise yep wait did we what did we find oh we found hematite okay so here's the other thing though you see how when you hover over these collections here it doesn't tell you the benefits of the crystals and i wish that it did if I'm looking at all my little crystal collections, everything I've collected, I want to see here what the benefits are, you know? But let me change my view to this. I know my little camera thing changed, but can you see this? Let me, let me hide. Wait, <laughs> I clearly was not prepared. Hide, 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 hide. Bookmarks. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Not Beyonce albums. What are we? What, what is this called? This is called uh, Crystal Creations Pack. Uh, EA Creator Network. I just want to. I just want to get the credit for being, you know honest about this okay so i'm going to spin for who's going to get the pack i did add an option to spin again just in case we get that that could be fun but remember if you are selected for the pack please immediately let me know either your instagram username or your tiktok username and let me know which one you're you're sharing because i will dm you after the stream either tonight or you know first thing tomorrow to make sure that you get your code, okay?
thanks to the EA Creator Network. All right, let's spin. Click to spin. Oh. And the winner is... <laughs> okay, we're gonna spin again. <laughs> Love that, love that for me, that that was on there. I'm so glad I landed on that first and that y'all saw that. <laughs> so, okay, I'm gonna remove spin again as an option. And now the winner, are y'all ready? Drum roll, please. Okay, click, I clicked. And the winner of the Crystal Creations Pack, courtesy of the EA Creator Network is... Mutha Sims! Congratulations! And thanks again to the EA Creator Network for gifting me a code to give away to Moop the Sims. Uh, please let me know, Moop, what your username is on TikTok or Instagram and let me know which of those um, is the, the one you're giving me. And yeah, you will get a copy of the Crystal Creation Stuff Pack. Congratulations! Okay, now, um, for the rest of this, let me go back to this view. Fantastic. Oh, did I? Oh, well, okay. Um, so, let me exit out on this and let me minimize this. All right, great. All right, well, this gave us three crystals. Also, what is going on with this guy? He's wearing a hood and he's got a beard, so he looks. I thought this was a glitch. Sir, I don't know why you're talking to me. Okay, I'm gonna go home. Yes, Moop, congratulations! <laughs> again, the spin again being the option that landed. Couldn't have planned that better myself. <laughs> okay. Julia, I'm gonna tell you right now. It says she's a ghost right there, but we're gonna hope that that was just because we were in the magic realm. Cause she's staying with us. So if when she left that she died, I would have been so mad. Look at her, she's sitting there looking alive. Look alive. Okay, okay, okay. So really quickly, dang, dang. Okay, I'm gonna cut. Oh no, I don't wanna resume. Oh shoot, I don't res wanna resume that one. But that's okay. That's okay because we'll we'll do something with the plum bite. <laughs> that was perfect, right. It was just, it was too, too funny. Too funny. But Moop, in the chat, drop what your Instagram username is or your TikTok username, all right? I went to the bathroom. Is this done? Oh, sorry y'all, I pressed the wrong button again. Resume. Should the plum bite be jewelry? Maybe it should be jewelry. Maybe I'll make myself a little bracelet. This music sounds like Taylor Swift, doesn't it? What station is this? Is this not Taylor Swift? It sounds like it. Um. <laughs> I'm glad, I'm glad you're happy. And thanks, thanks everyone for joining today. Thanks everyone for entering. Um, I really appreciate it. I also appreciate the support. I love when people are on stream with me. And yeah, I've had I've had a lot of fun today exploring this pack. Oh, okay. All right, sorry. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna design some jewelry. We're gonna design a bracelet. What is this? Delicate bracelet? I think we should design the delicate bracelet. Or maybe a ring? Basic ring, chunky ring, raw ring. Hmm. No, let's go with the bracelet. I had I wanted the bracelet. We're gonna do that, and we're gonna make it with flamingonium, and we're gonna use our plum bite. Yes. Okay, river artist. What is that on Instagram? Yep, it's me. Ah. Ugh. All right, she's. She's a little, she's a little stressed out. Now I did hear that two Sims could work on this table at once. So I'm gonna add uh, Julia to our family. Uh, 
Okay, actually, I'm gonna remove her from the family because it's being weird. Maybe because she's our stayover guest. Maybe I'll add someone else to our family. Who's walking by past? You. Who are you? Daniel Scott. Welcome to the family, Daniel Scott. <laughs> okay, so while I am over here working on uh, some jewelry, we're gonna have Daniel Scott. Oh my God, he's so sad. From sad stay over guests. Okay, sir, you just got here to be perfectly frank. We're gonna give him the turquoise and we're gonna have him cut. Oh, he can't do anything. We'll have him cut the that one with some turquoise, boom. Oh, right, river artist. That's what I wanted to see. Is this on Instagram? Let me know Moop, before I end up messaging somebody on Instagram. Imagine getting off work from your pizza shop and then being kidnapped to someone else's family. <laughs> right, that's, that's what I'm saying. Oh, what's this? Oh, we still have charge remaining 23 hours. So fun need doesn't decay. So how's it working for him? Yeah, look, his fun is all the way up. And he's feeling happy. He likes gemology, he don't know it yet. But I just wanted to show that two people could be working on this table at once, apparently. One person working on jewelry and one person working on uh, cutting a gemstone. And when he's done, I'm gonna kick him out because I don't want him in my house. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I'm just gonna check the Tiki Talk. Okay, uh, it looks like your underscore the the username that you just gave me, Moop. Can you confirm that it's the Instagram username? Oh, are you done? Okay, so this is she's feeling hungry. All right, so this is what we made with the plum bite. So this is the one that once it's charged, all of our needs slowly increase over time. So this is charging and it says six hours until fully charged. Hmm, oh, okay, so it will charge tonight. It'll be fine, it'll charge tonight and we are good with that. And then who is this guy? Daniel, right, Daniel is finishing doing something there. Now, oh, wait, 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 you know what else? What's the one that said it wasn't gonna start fires? Is it the amber? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, dang, I wanna, I actually wanna cut gemstones out of the amber, but that's okay. Do we need this? I don't think we need this. We're just gonna put this back on the charging grid and I'm gonna move this to here we now have a suitcase forever because they never take their suitcase back it's on a google doc do you have permission to share a link yeah is that the best way to get it to me right now yeah yeah i guess share the share the link share the link here yeah share the link here i guess i think it should work let's serve some samosa soup that's or am I wasting my time? Julia! Oh, Julia! Let's do a pickup line, Julia! How much longer do we have on this? Oh, it's drains! Boo! Rue Julia from all outfits. Boo! It's drained. Boo! Alright, well, Julia seemed receptive. Oh, it doesn't say drained. Or, or it seemed like it seemed like Mason was still getting the effect. Okay, let me let's just let's just charge some things. This is the one. Okay, yeah, we're charging all this stuff. That's fine. Uh, okay, 
Also, you were gonna make some soup. I think I canceled it because I was being a little horn dog. Let me try one more time. Uh, oh, did you finish? No, he didn't finish. He's still working on it. It's taking him a long time. He's just figuring out the gemology skill. I also don't know what her romantic interests are. There we go. We don't even have the thing on. Julia seems very receptive. Okay, now let's make some soup. Oh wait, no, that's not what I wanted. Serve dinner. We're gonna serve some soup for everyone. Okay, cool. I just messaged you on Instagram. Okay, so we're making some soup, crossing our fingers that there's no fires being set. Daniel's working on the thing that we need to not, wait, what is he working on again? I keep. Oh, he can now discuss crystal properties with other Sims. Listen, he's gonna be a better man for having joined us. Okay. Is he not having fun? Oh, his social need is low. Okay, so he worked on turquoise. Sims gain charisma skill faster and they're more successful with friendly um, interactions. It will be fully charged in six hours, which is exactly the amount of time. Uh, can you leave now? Remove from family. Exactly the amount of time until seven o'clock. Oh, I made, I finished making soup. Great. So when you hover over the grid, everything comes up. So we see everything that's charging and how long until it's fully charged. So that's good. Does Daniel have a family? Well, did he leave already? I don't think he does. Add to family. Let's, let's just see. Welcome back, Daniel. We don't have good compatibility? Why do we have awful compatibility? And he wants to become a spellcaster? Uh, he's gloomy, lazy, vegetarian, and a collector. Is this a vegetarian meal? Vegetarian safe. Why don't you come have, come have some soup before you leave. Well, let's check your family tree. No, he doesn't have any family or nothing. He's just a guy. It's Thursday. This thing doesn't like, uh, become fully grown until Sunday, I think. Also, why is everybody coming in here? Oh, Julian went to bed. All right, I'm, re I'm removing him from the family again. He's just a random guy. <laughs> Joined, but I'm putting it lightly. Okay, so we're going to, she's really tired, but I want you to cut the gemstone. We, we still can't level six, level eight. Ugh. Mm. I want the star, man. All right, how about this? Let's just design something random. Design random jewelry. And then, cause I want that one that doesn't start fires. It worked out with the soup, but still. Also poor little Regine. You good Regine? You hungry or something? She's all right, she's jumping on counters. I usually frown upon this, but it's a free rain let's play girl. So do, do you. All right. Okay, great. No, I see you messaged me back. Yes. Okay, I'll get you the, co the code. Um, So, yes. All right, so she's making random jewelry. It, I, w I wonder what she's making. It doesn't say. Okay, so we have the, this is fully charged. This is the one where the fun need won't decay. So that's good. And then these are, everything's charging as normal. I'm gonna super speed through. 
She's V tired, but that is all right with me. Oh, and she's almost about to level up so we can cut some um, star shaped gemstones. So that would be great for me. Okay, so we finished that. What did you make? And does it actually need to be charged? She made a necklace with ruby. And she also needs to go to sleep. So just go to sleep, it's fine. Oh my God, do you guys see Regine sleeping on the couch? It's so cute. Oh, she was sleeping. Oh my God, that's how Maxine actually sleeps sometimes. Just all curled up like that. Where is she? I don't know where she is. Okay, what else? Um. Okay, cool. Now. All right, Julia left. Oh, 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 oh. So the crystals are done charging. So here's what I wanna do. Get up. You don't need anything else. She's feeling dazed. Dang it, she's starting to burn out. All right, let's use the plum bite. We're going to collect, let's collect items and we're gonna collect everything. And let's come over here and collect items as well. Or I don't think, oh yeah, we can collect all this because it looks like it's charged. So come out here, she's feeling dazed, which is unfortunate. And then we're going to put on the plumbite because I just want to see it in action. So we're going to wear with all outfits. And then where's that little rose necklace? Uh, let's wear with all outfits as well. Let's go start hitting on Julia again. Did you leave? Are you back? Wait, don't leave. No, no, she faded away. All right, let's call her back. Maybe, maybe she thinks she's gonna do something, but she doesn't need to do something. Uh, send text, oh, dang it. Why is it plan stay over there? She is our stay over guest. All right, well, I'm chatting with her. Or maybe I wasn't chatting with her. Okay, so she's wearing the bracelet. Everyone see this. And you see, first of all, the bracelet, super, super cute. Second of all, everything's slowly going up. This is, this is the best one, honestly. And it has two days remaining for charge. So to me, this is the one. Oh yeah, we should propose to her. So yeah, let's cut, let's design some jewelry and let's make a ring. We're gonna make a ring for Julia. We're gonna do the bling ring. We're gonna use punium and maybe we can propose with emerald. What's hematite gonna do? Sim can't die. Oh shoot. Okay, we're gonna make her a ring and then we're also going to cut Level six. Okay, maybe when we're done with this ring, we can cut the star shape in the amber. Yeah, look look how close we are. Also, do we have any law trades to help us? I don't really think so. First of all, great soil. We always, I always turn on great soil at home. Then home studio. And where's romantic aura? Yeah, we're gonna do all this, cool. Yeah, we, we hope that Julia is, is down, is down. Baby, are you down, 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 down? Down. Oh, oh, she just smacked herself in the face. Sorry, girl. You would think at level, what is she, level five? <gasps> Julia's back. Julia. Okay, well, let's finish our ring. Let's finish our ring. One thing at a time. Oh, she has class. Maybe that's what's going on. She keeps leaving and coming back at just random hours of the day. Okay, sweet. First of all, she finished this. Second of all, will it even let us propose? Huh. So maybe we have to be like, like ready. You know what I mean? Ready to go. All right, let's start flirting. Also, did we figure out what her interests were? Okay, we did. Ask a single? That's, that's never stopped me. What am I even talking about? Absolutely, that's never stopped me. Okay, yeah, she's open. 
Smirgus. And also, don't we have some crystals that have charged? Oh, Let's leave this. Oh, wow. Did you guys see that? There's a slot underneath this little desk down here. That's super cool. Okay, the, the amethyst isn't charged. Let me put this out just in case I forget. That needs to charge. Also, it's a full moon tonight, so everything's gonna. We need to get everything out that we want. Can I put this out? Oh, you can. You can store your crystals in the desk itself. So anybody who comes here can use this stuff. This is cool. So I'm gonna put all of my crystals and metals in the desk. Learn something new today. Oh, I don't know what just happened, but I'm gonna apologize. And you're also very sad. Can you not be sad? I'm trying to do a thing here. Maybe affection? No. Let's get to know, try to cheer up. Let's do all of these things. Friendly, deep thoughts. I don't wanna just be friends. We can share ideas. The piece of the every man is like, what am I doing here? Right. All right. I don't know where Daniel went. Daniel didn't like us though. That's the only thing. I didn't like Daniel either, but still. Oh, hello. Um, first kiss. Will it not fail? I also love the soundtrack to our first kiss. Oh wow, we're having our first kiss. The magical necklace is working. <laughs> I do feel like it's a little, what's the word I'm looking for? Like I said, it's giving very much Ursula. Oh, we can woohoo in the shower? Is she still gonna wear the necklace? No, 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 she takes off the necklace, but that'd be funny if, they, if she still had the necklace on. <laughs> Workshop desk is convenient. I hope the Sims team continues with this sort of thing. Yes, I agree. Oh my gosh, do you see Regine? Regine! Ma'am! Can you give us some privacy? She, I don't know if Regine approves. Regine's like, I don't know about her. Oh no, is she hot? Oh. Regine. First of all, let's get rid of this. Second of all, um, I want, is it, uh, oh yeah, it's here. Okay, let's get one of these. And then the other thing I want is I want that table. This one, yeah. What color do we want? I kind of want the teal. Mm, no, let's just go with this orangey one. Oh. I know this like doesn't matter at all, but in my mind, as long as, as long as um, I have the little table there, it might as well have a couple little things on it. You know what I'm saying? Like where are the keys? The keys and the phone. I would search for it, but I'm not exactly sure what it's called. And apparently you need to know exactly what things are called in order to look for them. Oh my god, this little item, super cute, love that. Uh, I see... This is it's too much stuff, it's too much stuff. Let me just go to the clutter kit. Is it everyday clutter? This one, yeah. Okay, cool. And pink phone, pink keys. Yeah, all right, cool. You know, just a couple of things. Well, Mason and Julia get it on. Okay, so that was that. Where'd Julia go? Maybe she had another class? 
All right, let us cut some gemstones. And I wanna cut the star gemstone finally out of amber. And loving this oh, in wow. general. So let's also, oh my God, Julia wants to go on a date? Julia, I was in the middle of, what also, what? where did she go? Where did she go that she's like, oh yeah, let's, let's go on a date. Didn't you have class? Maybe she got to class and she was like, you know what, screw it. Oh, I can't save yet. Okay, y'all, this is gonna be the make it or break it date. I've got my little jewelry piece on and we need to make Julia our fiance. I'm just double checking to make sure that this still has a charge. It says drained. Oh my God. Who's this guy? Ooh, the passionate kiss really did something. This date just keeps getting better. Oh, we should also be friends. Flirtation. Oh wait, I keep flirting. Friendly, deep thoughts. Ask about love life, I guess. Also, don't do we have not have the option to like ask to be girlfriend or are we just not there yet because <laughs> We're not really that much of friends. Huh. So okay, I'm gonna keep, or I guess we're just gonna keep talking. Deep conversation, cool. I wish I had one of the things that was like, we have um, good like, just regular friendly interactions. I think I left it at home. Because nothing else here oh. is charged for Three. that sort of thing. <laughs> for Roby, physique, fuzz <laughs> Oh, in a prep <laughs> Also, no one's bought our stuff from Plopsy. <sighs> Today's the last day for this. So I guess we'll see. Okay, come on. Keep, keep, keep talking. What happened to her? What do you mean? What happened to who? Who's her? Oh my gosh, who is this little person? This person is so cute. Celine? I also want to meet Celine. Hi Celine. Alright, Julia. We're not we're not getting friendly enough fast enough. Oh, she's hungry too. Okay, we're gonna have to order Julia some food. Can we be in a group? Oh, we are in a group. Okay, okay, okay. Let me, can I order us some food or is Julia gonna order her own food? Oh, she's ordering some chips. Okay. She's, I like how she's like, I'm just so hungry. Maybe I can order some French fries. Am I even hungry? I'm definitely not even hungry because I've got the plum bite thing on. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. How much longer for that? It's interesting. It says it's drained, but remember when we were on the house, it said it had two days of charge left. Oh, someone wants to purchase something from us on Plopsy. Thank gosh. And they're going to buy it for 1300 simoleons. Yes. Okay. When we get back, we've got to, we've got to send that off. Hello, Coral. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, okay, so Julia, Julia, let us kiss. So, welcome Coral. What we're doing today is we're playing with the Crystal Creations Pack, thanks to the A Creator Network for gifting me a copy of um, the Crystal Creations Pack so I can play it. And then also, I did already give away my copy of the Crystal Creations Pack via, or from the EA Creator Network. Uh, that was won by Moop, so congrats again, again, Moop. I'm still hanging out here because I think the thing that I'm trying to do, okay, is I want a fiance. So I want to propose with a ring, but we're not good enough friends. We are doing a lot of flirting because I have this necklace on a magical oh, yeah. necklace that helps us with our romance, oh, which is why Kimmy. our romance Swash bar I think is so high, but our friendship bar is a little mid right now. 
So we are trying to become better friends because I want to make her my fiance. Uh, let's keep, let's just keep deep con conversing. And the question is, can I even propose? Oh, well, let's ask to be girlfriend. That's at least the next step. Yeah, look how high this romance bar is. This is all thanks to the necklace, baby. That ruby is doing the thing. Look at that, we got a girlfriend now. Now, can I propose to you immediately? I know that's moving fast, but you know how queer women are. You know, we just move. Bam, bam, we know, we know. Okay, we the girlfriend thing hasn't gone through yet. Okay, Julia just became the girlfriend of Mason. Now, if I look at this, <gasps> propose to Julia. Do you think she'll say yes, y'all? Also, do we want to propose here in the werewolf world? Eh, eh now it's as good a time as any. Blurva. We're gonna propose. Julia, I know I just asked Blurva. you to be my girlfriend, but oh, will God, you Bush. marry me? Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. She said yes! With the ring that I made! Wow! And just like that, baby, in her flip flops and her crop top, she is my fiance. Oh, and she oh, and she's like rubbing my cheek. Oh my gosh. Julia! It is it this is great. We could have look look at this. All thanks to the necklace. <laughs> Yeah, wait, wait, can you, can you tell? <laughs> this is my sim self. <laughs> Did she look like me? <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, okay. All right, well, this was a great date. We're gonna let the date write it out. I know Julia's gonna have a great time because she literally just became my fiance. Uh, I'd elope immediately with you, but that's not one of the things that comes with the pack. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Let's do another friendly thing. We don't need the necklace anymore. I had such a great time with you. Let's do that again soon. Sure, Julia. Let's go back home. <laughs> okay. So we're going to, oh my gosh. My cat's here. Maxine, hey yo. I wonder if she'll come up. If she comes up, I'll show I'll show Maxine to y'all. But she's being, you know, she's being a cat. She's being a little weird. So the question is, at this point, oh wait, we gotta we gotta send off our thing from Plopsy so we can get thirteen hundred simoleons from our ne our little ring. Remember when I said I wasn't sure? Okay, all right. So she just okay. Remember when I said I wasn't sure if she was gonna be able to sell that, but she oh. did. She made 1,300 uh. simoleons. Okay, so that was great, cause that was way more, I think that ring was worth like 200 maybe? This is worth 200. I should have checked how much the ring was worth. Okay, so let's list this on Plopsy. Uh. And we're gonna remove the jewelry from all outfits. I'm gonna resume my star-shaped gemstone. It is seven o'clock, so things are charging now, okay? Things are, I heard you became friends with Julia Wright. No, she's my fiance. Get it right, ma'am. Okay, oh no, the raw necklace's listing has expired. It must be this one. I don't know. It says something expired, but it doesn't look like it. Is it this one? Oh, did I have this listed? I don't think I did. I got a lot of stuff. Uh, whatever, I'm just gonna charge. I'm gonna charge all this stuff. Ooh. So the amethyst is charging. This says it's drained, but it says it's drained, but our needs are still good. Also, y'all look at the amount of moodlets that are here. Oh, you wonder if spell, okay, so I did see, I did see James Turner. He played with spellcasters and he, um, 
use the Reperio spell to improve the quality of the jewelry that was made. Cause he made like poor quality jewelry, but then when he used Reperio, it moved up to like normal or excellent. And then he was able to copy and paste with the copy paste so spell. So you can, you can enhance the jewelry with the Reperio spell. Can you charge the jewelry with any spells? No, but you can make things better quality. Okay, really, Regine? Okay, well, she's upset by something. I just want the star-shaped amber. Now, you see how these crystal grids are like really, really glowing? It's because we have a full moon. So everything is gonna charge super fast. Look, the raw necklace that we have here is already charged. Uh, Julia is going through it over here. I see her crying. Oh! Regine! What are you doing? Uh, okay. Uh, the cat is in the desk. I will deal with that in a moment. Now, what's happening here? Does this need to be charged? It says charge remaining two hours. I'm just, or 22 hours, excuse me. So I'm gonna load all this stuff on here. I'm gonna have her take off the plum bite. Remove jewelry, remove from all outfits. Now, the other question is, now that I have found plum bite in the world, can I, uh, Cut a plumbite gemstone. Cannot be purchased. So we always have to find plumbite out in the world. Okay. What else do we have? We have alabaster. Oh, let's cut alabaster because Julia's feeling some type of way right now. And it would be nice so that she, if she didn't feel like that. Now, do we have any crystals out here? Because if so, we might have a chance of finding something like rare, like the plumbite, like this. Yeah, let's dig that up. I don't know if you saw, but I could tell that there's little rocks and stuff in here. Or little crystals in there. And then what's this? This is a metal. Uh, I really don't care to find anything but crystals, if I'm honest. Because even metals, because there's no, nah, no Daniel ain't calling me to check out the ruins. He don't even like me for real. He just joined the family at one point, so he feels like he knows me. Uh, okay, I also find some more crystals here. If you zoom in, you can see his crystals. Oh, she found multiple because she's got that ability now. So we found Simonite and we found Jet and Jet is rare. Jet, we can summon the Grim Reaper at will. And we can succeed with um, pleading for someone's life. Ooh. Oh, look, we found two medals too. So we're gonna have to make something with Jet just so we can summon the Grim Reaper and be like, hey, what's up? She wants to dance to stereo mu music and listen to winter holiday music and R&B music. Does she like winter holiday music? If I set that, that's hilarious. Cause I do like winter holiday music, but like at winter holiday time, you know? Yep, yep, <sighs> yep, great. Oh, nurture your crystal tree. I don't think there's anything I can do. She doesn't have high enough gardening skill. Uh, we, we can water it. Good looking out, you're so right. Oh no, we're also getting mental fog. We dug up a time capsule. Now, let me tell the, the the irony of finding two crystals from one little thing and then not finding any crystals on the second thing. Like, this is the kind of thing that makes me mad in this game. Cause I was surely thinking we were about to have four crystals. Look at this. Here's a crystal thing over here. Let's do that. Oh yeah, she likes gardening. Yes, you like gardening, sure. I'm just looking for any more crystals. Oh no, she's burned out. 
Ah! Uh, we found fire, opal, and ruby. Wait, what? Fire, opal, more successful with romance, complete dates successfully. We don't need that. And we already know ruby. What is one that will help us um with burnout is there anything that will help us with burnout okay let's come over here why can't i cut a gemstone the gemology table needs to be empty once again y'all wasting my time here okay now cut a gemstone i'm gonna select i love this one but let's do this one because i haven't done that one in a minute now Sims wants, I don't care about that. Brave, fun, energy, convince. Okay, no. Is it just, um, what's it, the, the orange topaz? take longer to burn out on create creative activities but there's nothing that'll help us when we're already burned out okay hmm oh sims will take longer to burn out on mental activities okay but again not like oh you will recover from burnout really fast that's okay Angry, embarrassed, sad, or scared moodlets will fade, but burnout is like a dazed moodlet. You know, the crystals don't help with every little thing, but they help with a lot of things. They help with a lot of things, so I, I'm not even mad. And it still leaves room to be challenged. That's the other thing. So me being mindful in the future about burnout and like what crystals help with burnout is something I can pay attention to in the future. Uh, okay, so what, what do we have charged here? Is everything charged? We're waiting for the star-shaped gemstone to charge. I'm going to unlist these from Plopsy. And there's nothing to do with this plant. The plant will be grown in two days. So I think that I'm going to stay on stream until this grows because I don't have any cheats in my game or any mods in my game to make this grow. Oh, set gardening state. What am I talking about? What am I talking about? I don't have any cheats in my game, but this must just be, so I, what I did was I shift clicked and I have testing cheats on maybe. Okay, so in the morning, we'll see what we can harvest from the tree. I'm so excited. I, Cause I was like, I don't wanna wait two days for this to grow. <laughs> What's this too? A wild sage brush. Okay. I didn't even know we had sage in this neighborhood. Let me ask you to move in. Regine is running away. <laughs> Why? Regine. Oh, please don't run away, Regine. She did. She didn't like. Oh no. She, oh God, is she really about to leave? Are you serious right now? Please don't. What? what? <laughs> Maybe she won't run away. Oh my god, I would be so devastated if my cat ran away. Can I just, can you just not run away, please? This is so strange. I keep clicking. It says she's running away, but then she's still here. Can I go, what's wrong you? Talk to you. Okay, it says she's running away again. Can I hug you? Don't leave. It's a wild way to propose.
feed her. What do you mean feed her? There's food. She can eat. There is food. I checked. It doesn't stink too. I've had that issue where the food was like smelly. But no, the food's fine. She just, I think she just needs attention. But it won't let me, here, let me reset her. Let's give her a big treat, maybe. Okay, she's not running away. I'm still able to interact with her. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get to know. Oh my god, it keeps saying that she's running away. Oh my gosh. And what is this? Did she just age up or something? No. I'm gonna lecture you about jumping on the counters though. Get down. Okay. So all my needs are basically fine because I had that plum bite on for so long. Oh, now she's hiding under the bed. Oh my gosh. Let's travel. Let's just travel because I just, I don't know if it's like bugged out or what. I'm so upset. I'm so, like, please, Regine, don't leave. Don't leave. Okay, all of those moodlets that we had earlier are all gone. Now we're just leave left with feeling fulfilled, engaged, and burnt out. Experiencing burnout. And that's it. There's no way to be like, oh, let's uh, undo it by doing this or that. Is there anything we can do that to help with that? Maybe play? Does this help with our burnout? Let's see. Oh, no, 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 no. This makes it worse. This makes it worse. Oh, someone commented on Plopsy. Your lunar goddess ring arrived. Is, is it supposed to smell like this? <sighs> Don't piss me off. Now, do we have a TV in here? We don't, but let's get a frame TV in here. Can you imagine a TV at the park? A nice TV at the park? Let's do that one. All right, let's watch TV. Watch a movie. The cat is being too emo. That's what I'm saying. That's why I left. It says she's at home. I'm just hoping that it like bugs out in such a way. Look, her burnout's going down now that she's watching a movie. Great. We're doing relaxing things. We got to get rid of this burnout. You think it'll mess with our burnout if we also dig up some things? <laughs> Keep her on the crystal grind. Uh, Daniel, I don't even know you. Does talking with Sims help us with burnout? Maybe we can call up Daniel. And be like, hey man. Or where's our other little friend, the bartender? The cool bartender. Let's uh let's chat with her. She's she's cool. We have neutral compatibility too. And where's where Daniel go? Did we even meet him? Oh yeah, we did. He just yeah. All right, let's chat. Let's chat with Daniel too. All this would lower our burnout. We have twelve hours. Julia's calling. You think I should get a new job? Yeah, girl. You're a student now though, so I don't know what that means. Oh, I should have brought that plum bite with us. Um. Oh, Best Drilling is here? We got all the townies. Let's grill some food. Ugh, I'm always making mushroom steak. Three Sisters Chili. I don't know where you got the ingredients to make it, but yeah, do that. This is the first time I've had to take care of her needs in a minute. Grab a serving of that, please. And then we can go use the bathroom. You said you love how she's watching static. <laughs> right. Okay, so she's using the bathroom. Okay, cool. I mean, we're basically good. How much longer do we have on this burnout? 10 hours. Oh my God. Ooh, and it's hot out here too. All right, let me look, let me look for some more crystals. You think she'll be mad if we dig it up? It is a skill that we're getting. So it's not just like, just fun. What's here? Ugh. 
Nobody wants the fossils. Not today anyway. One day I'm gonna want the fossils. But right now, it's all about the metals, baby. <gasps> metals, yes. Go dig that up. Let's see if that affects her burnout. If that increases her burnout, then we probably have to step away from gemology for a little bit. Julia. Yeah, get to know whoever you want as a friend, Julia. It's none of my business. Oh, here's some more medals. So this is a pretty reliable place to go to dig up things for spawning. But it is a little crazy how difficult it is to get crystals. Okay, she's taking her sweet time. Girl, you don't dig up these metals. She's like laboring in the hot sun. Okay, she found Fosanite and Romantium. And a robot salvage part. <sighs> Have her sleep to make the day go faster. Yeah, let's do that. All right, let's go home. Uh, okay, that was a little odd. Uh, okay, did we get crystals? <gasps> yes, harvest, harvest all. Okay, wait, before she harvests it, let me just so i'm very clear about what we get let me move all of this to the desk i want to see how many crystals we get i'm going to see what crystals we get and i want to see how rare they are in fact multi-select can i get rid of all this look at all these why do we have all these salvage parts okay sell all these thank you and then 274. We're going to relist this stuff on Plopsy too. Just to see. Or maybe we can gift. No, no, no. We're going to relist. Okay. All right. So what does she get from this tree? We got four crystals. So we harvested sapphire. Emerald. Now these are common, common, and common. Either way, though, we got four crystals just from growing a crystal tree. That's pretty dope. And we could grow more trees to get more crystals at a time. That's a good point, actually. Okay, so I just wanted to check to see how this crystal would look. And it looks super dope also. And then how charged is all this stuff? Like, look at all this stuff look at all this okay okay so she's she is gonna go to bed right and i just want to show you guys how this looks so i'm gonna put this on the nightstand and then she's gonna go to sleep and this amber i said i wanted this in the kitchen for when she's cooking this we're gonna put this on this desk for julia this is alabaster. Oh, Regine's running away again. So yeah, I'll try not to be concerned. Oh, stuff is charging again. Okay, but if you see here, you see her energy's like all the way up already. She hasn't even been asleep that long, but it's because of the amethyst. If you see here, look, look, look. Walking on sunshine for being near charged amber. That's not it. Everlasting merriment. Also not it. Wait, is Dream Reavers rest? <laughs> Dream Reavers rest from being nearby charged amethyst. Oh my gosh! Good night, Noop. Noop. Good night, Moop. And also, don't worry. I I need to request your code, so do not worry about it. Let me send you a message.
Okay. Great. Um, okay, so I am going to wrap it up now because I, I basically am, I'm on longer than I normally would be, but I had so much fun tonight. Um, so I hope you also enjoyed the stream and I hope you learned more about the Crystal Creations pack, everything that comes with the pack, both in cast, build by, and some of the gameplay and the gameplay effects. Uh, we even got a fiance like really quickly tonight just from using like a magical necklace. So I think that this pack has so much potential to be super integrated in your gameplay if you like want to use the effects and whatnot. So yeah, if you haven't gotten the back, I think that you totally should because it's so much fun to play with. But I hope you have a great rest of your evening and I hope you enjoy the stream. Until next time, y'all. Um, also, actually, before I leave, I do have my... Crystal Magic Let's Play. I have that episode going live tomorrow. So look out for that as well. If you want to see me play more with spellcasters and with this pack. So yeah. Anyway, have a good night. Thank you all for joining. Bye-bye.